I'd be a bit more reserved. What if we have a reserved? <laughs> Sorry, Ron. I was just going to say, what if we have a window. reserved, nice show today where everyone's polite to each other? I'm down. You know what? Fuck you! You know no. what, buddy? <laughs> You're... You only make me stronger with insults like that. Your quickness to anger offends me on a base human level. We got Rob and Austin with us today. Yeah, hey, how's it going? Hello. At some point, I'm going to recognize you as two different individuals and stop introducing well, you. you. There. But yeah. the, I mean, but the problem is, like... I don't want to say Austin and Rob, because then it's like I said Austin's name first, but I don't want to say Rob and Austin, because then it doesn't sound like Austin Rob anymore. Right, right So it's right, like, yeah. it's a constant problem. Mm -hmm. Anyway, no, what that's seriously has to stop resetting my character every five seconds. <laughs> mm, yeah, it's okay, yeah. though. Done. We're going to play Ultimate Chicken Horse, and then we're going to play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, and then we're going to play, uh, what's the last game on the list? It's uh, London 2012, that's uh, London. right. London 2012. London. The um, only game that's also a broil. Why don't Oof. they make uh, Who Wants to Be a Gorillionaire? Because that's what I really want to do, honestly. Why don't they make Who Wants to Be London? That would be even better. Hey, why don't they make a game that's called Who Wants to Shut the Fuck Up and Get the Show Started? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds no, like we're stupid. playing that game right, All right now, Okay, okay, we? Waterfall. Let's go Waterfall. Where the hell is my I was just setting stick? up a Nick's Funhouse for you guys. Oh, oh, I didn't change the score title. Oh, there, the oh, 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 okay, 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 okay. I haven't done a Funhouse in a while. We have no Josh today. I don't know why, but he was on on Thursday. So he'll he'll be back at some point. He was probably like, I own a house. <laughs> oh. Got to clean the gutters today. Oh, got to go meet with my <laughs> financial advisor. <laughs> yeah, what a go. nerd. Got to meet back <laughs> Nice. Oh, there nice. Yeah, suck on that, Rob. All right, oh, true sorry, or false? Sorry, God damn okay. it. One true, or false. True, or false. true or false? True or false? I have never broken a bone. True. I... False. True. Okay, if you said true, you're correct. Nice. All right. Good job. Five hundred dollar question coming up next. Wait, All Austin, right. what bone did you break? Well, no, I thought we were trying to guess. Oh, 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 wait, we're... I, I meant uh, for him to guess for me, uh, and then we're all gonna guess our own. So it's like we've got, like, a weird inverted never have I ever here. Yeah. Oh, uh, why even try for the coin? Like, let's... <laughs> Honor. We want to do it. So Nick has never broken a bone. Yes. Yeah. Yes. All right, so I'm gonna say Ryan hasn't broken a bone. That's correct. I'm gonna say Rob has broken at least four bones. <laughs> Actually, okay, I've never broken a bone really, but um, I did break my toe once. If that kind of counts. I don't think do that mean? counts. Actually, I don't think it is. I don't think it does either. That's why I still. What are you myself. setting up over there, guys? <laughs> <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> okay, no, why does no, the toe I'm a dick. broken toe doesn't count as a bone? Why? Because it's like, when you go in there, they don't give you a toe cast. They just go, ah, it'll heal yeah. on its own. Like, it's gonna be painful for a while, and then it'll be fine. So I didn't even go to the doctor when I broke my toe. Well, how do you know you broke it, not then? A bone? Because my toe was in excruciating pain, and my entire foot was blue. A hundred percent chance that oh. does not count. <laughs> if, you didn't not have a, if you didn't have an x-ray on your toe, that's not a broken toe. <laughs> Who did it? God fucking damn it. Why? <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs> Too easy now? No, I just like, like this is the worst thing for like two reasons. <laughs> Rob, was that you? What are you talking about? Are it's we like, like desynced or something? Cause this looks so easy for me. No, it's, yeah, it's he pretty made easy. A fun, he made a friendship wheel. Oh. <laughs> oh, he did do it. I no, didn't want to do that. Not real. <laughs> on fucking Holocaust Remembrance Day. <laughs> Wait, what? It's Holocaust Remembrance Day. You did sort of yeah. make... That's I mean, all, all I see I is a London anything. 2012 athlete kneeling down ready to fling a discus over his exactly. head. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah that's and way better. Kind of and like he's an alpaca, because look at his long nose. Yeah. He's going, <gasps> Oh, I fell off that thing. I didn't know we were spinning it. <laughs> Never. I do not condone this <gasps> action. Never have but, I ever okay. failed a class. No, I have. Um. Wait, are we guessing you or are we doing our own? I don't know. You made the rules. I <laughs> meant for us to all do our own individually yeah, okay. and then go around. Right. Okay. I I have never failed a class. 
Uh, I was gonna say that you have failed the class because it would be unexpected. I mm. think you. So it's a compliment, even though very it doesn't sound like it. Yeah. I think you have never failed a class. I think you have failed a class. I have not failed a class. All okay. Right. I have huh? I have dropped a class I was probably going to fail. Oh God! That counts. Right? That does not count. I dropped it in week that... six. Okay, out of, out of that early. Still could have passed. That probably counts. Not. The only way it counts. It does that you not failed. count. No, no, no. Sorry, I'm agreeing with you. It doesn't count. I'll the show you the crown scores. Is if it goes through. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And I've gotten right. like a 53 in another class, but I mean, that's the fail. Not in Canada. Oh, that's oh that's shit. Kind of a fail, though. It's that not a, a fail. fail. <laughs> 50 Dude, we is a fail at 69. If you get a 69, you fail. Why are your yeah. courses? Yeah. Why are your courses so easy? That a 69 <laughs> is a fail. Some of our courses, 69 is the class average. You have to do a much higher standard against her. <laughs> that is a fail in Canada. It's not a fail in Canada. It's a fail in parts of Canada, maybe. You want to see a picture of my fucking degree? It's got a stamp on it from Principal Daniel Wolf. It's even got an it's even got an H after the B period S C. Daniel H Wolf. No. Fuck me in the ass. Ooh. Um, I don't think good... I failed a class. It's a my coin. I definitely failed, I think, every one of my classes during my first semester of college. That's actually, really? like, that's like, horrible. Yeah, <laughs> I stopped going. <laughs> yeah, oh. I guess that'll do it. I have yeah. nightmares about that all the time. Not going to class. Yeah, I mean... That, it turned that, out Exactly fine. what Austin actually lived through. Like, I have that nightmare <laughs> all the time. Well, I saw it coming. I was like, I didn't do any of the work. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I failed all of these final tests. <laughs> There's no way. I oh, that, what am I thinking? Actually, in you history know, you know class, second second year, I think, and his policy was you didn't have to come to class as long as you passed the tests. Yeah, that's and a I was good like, policy. I was like, dude, that is the trap. Obviously, that is a trap, and everyone's not going to come to class, and they're going to fail a class. You want to know what I did? Went to class. Didn't go to class. Fucking went didn't to class, go to class and, and failed. Fail. <laughs> that was unexpected. Yeah. Dude, it's always yeah, I, I got the exact thing I knew was the trap. Yeah. I gotta talk to chat here. Because everyone's going like, wow, I wish I went to school in Canada. Do you have no concept of the fact that like people are like, oh in my class I've gotta get a 98 or I failed. Oh. Yeah, um Are you seeing this? Yeah, that's what? broken, right? Yeah. That's that, an angle that can't. What do I do now? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I, I wanna see what it does. I think you can wall jump. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, I like that. Bro, <laughs> people are like, the questions are like, you know, what is your name? What is the date yeah. today? You know, I guess I better talk to like uh, my housemate who was like a triple major in mechanical engineering, astronomy, and physics, and be like, oh, sorry, you know, you had like a a sixty five in your mechanical engineering class, and you know, you got your degree, and now you're going to space. It turns out you're actually stupid, and if you were in America, you wouldn't have made it. <laughs> Well, it's true. Shit. Shit. He wouldn't have. Oh, oh. goddammit. Okay, He's not going so to space. Go next. Oh! Okay, good. I don't know. I'm thinking of a good one. I haven't got one yet. Rob, you got one? It's still broken. Uh, never have I ever... I mean, you know what? Before you even say it, I'm just going to say you have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's uh, kind of hard for Rob because all of yours are just like... Oh, okay. <laughs> Never have I ever been in a car crash. Ooh. You know what? Sorry, oh, Austin. God, maybe... Yeah, no, I have. Uh... You... I think I you didn't... have because that would be surprising. I mean, you got yeah. hit by a car once. Yeah. I don't know if that counts. That... I guess it's like you have to be in a car. Count. No, I think you have to be in a car. Yeah. I've, I've been in a car crash. a minor crash. fender bender. Like, does that count? That I think that counts because that's I'm counting that's it for not... myself. Well, I'd say I think if your car hits another car, well, I don't know. Were you, were you just like parked and then it could kind of bumped into you or something? Yeah, it's basically that. All right, no. I don't know if that counts. There was no chance of anyone being injured, and it was like not even a deal. Like nobody cared really. I got into an accident once. I was like four, which I really shouldn't have been driving, but. 
No, my mom. <laughs> my mom hit. What were you doing? Hit or got hit by another car? I'm not sure, but we were we were going like 20 kilometers an hour, so it wasn't like it wasn't anything. Rob, how fast is that? Uh, uh <laughs> 70 miles an hour. Fuck, that's really yeah. fast. <laughs> yeah, no, we all died actually. So oh, no. <laughs> I gotta try to put some more glue on this thing just to Hell see. Hell yes. Yeah. <laughs> so wait, Rob, what's the answer? Uh. If minor fender benders count, then yes. Okay. Because basically what happened is, uh, one time I was driving with Dennis, and uh, Dennis does this thing Dennis. when he drives where he doesn't watch the road, he just keeps looking at the radio and turning the dial on it. Yeah, that's bad. <laughs> um, that's very Dennis. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, and like, you'll, you'll listen to like the first 30 seconds of every song on the radio <laughs> on every station, but you won't listen to any full songs. Um, anyway, he was doing that when we were coming off of a uh, off of a highway to uh, around one of those one of those turns, and, uh, and we smashed into <laughs> some rocks. What do you mean one of those turns? <laughs> like a, a really hard turn around. Yeah, the the, like the really. The oh, really, I see. Yeah, yeah. You know. Why? Is, is this doable? Still, not yet. Anymore? Well, I mean, it's a masher now. That thing in the middle, I thought oh, was going to no. be connected oh. to the diagonal glue, but it was. It is not. Oh, I'm dead. I can't believe we found a new bug. Like, I thought our <laughs> days of bug finding were over. Oh, never. One of those never turns. <laughs> I was, I, 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 this is kind of spoiling an upcoming Battlegrounds episode, because I talked about it there too, but I was in an accident <laughs> going 60 miles an hour. Yeah. And, uh, That's a lot of miles. It was a lot of miles in, in one hour. Um, How many kilometers is that? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that, that's 100 kilometers an hour, almost exactly. Wow. Yeah, no, I, I centered the brake, so I don't know how fast I was going when I actually hit the other car. Thankfully, not even the police. Yeah, <laughs> right. There was just a lady talking on her fucking cell phone. Yeah. And she Aww. just pulled out in front of me on a on a small highway, and I just hit her. And it was it was it's pretty terrifying because the airbag springs up, and then you hit it, and everything just goes white for like three seconds. Jeez. It's like exactly like in the movies, like everything's in slow motion. You kind of just like look around a little bit and then everything kind of comes back all at once. Like, wow. It's, crazy. it's like when you get hit with a flashbang in Call of Duty. Pretty much yeah. exactly like that. It's it, <laughs> almost like to a T. Actually, but to that same point. Oh my god, the flashbang. <laughs> look at it. Do you see the angled like, things moving? Yeah. All together? Yeah. All right. Well, anyway, um, <laughs> in, a, in a similar uh, Call of Duty like moment. Um, one time, uh, I had this football, and I was sitting in my, I had just been, I had just been playing, uh, outside with my friends, uh, in college, right, you're just tossing the football around, came back inside, holding the football to my chest, um, now I had pumped the football before we went out. Jesus, this is a very involved story. <laughs> Because here's the thing that happened. Is that he, that my, my point was that we had been using this thing for like an hour or two. I sit down at my desk and the thing explodes <laughs> against my chest. Jesus. And it makes this, it makes a, a sound so loud that everyone in the dorm hallway comes out and they're like, is, are we under attack? Like what's happening? <laughs> And me and my friends like stumble out of the room, and it's it was like it's like Saving Private Ryan, you know? <laughs> oh my god! Out, like, and we're like stumbling out of the room. It was horrifying. I had, I had a big red mark on my chest. It was, it was, did it hurt real bad? It didn't hurt that bad, but it, it did fuck up my ears. Like that was it was insane. It's like football stigmata or something. Yeah, yeah. So never over pump a football. Like you're gonna basically. wake up with like bloody ring fingers where like your Super Bowl trophy should be <laughs> didn't that one football team do exactly that though yeah that's Tom Brady did that he what killed was wrong a, with him he killed a man with the football yep. oh my god he, he punched so hard at so his foot that it people. just you know, oh just we're lost. killing ourselves aren't we okay yeah totally I was doing that <laughs> you scum Gum sandwich. I didn't say yes. <laughs> anyway. Okay, who's next? Who's got another one? It's Austin's turn. Fuck, I ain't got shit, man. I, I, I got no interesting, like, things that I... I don't know. Give me another minute here. Give me another minute. Okay. Alright. 
Um, I was too invested in, one in Mississippi in two Rob's Mississippi. football story. All right, Nick, it's your it's your go. Uh, I have like really benign ones that are so like not interesting. Oh, but then we uh, know that they're true if you say them. That's true. Uh, never have I ever been stung by a bee. Wow. Um, I believe you have been stung by a bee. Probably, yeah. I'm gonna say no. You, no, I've been stung by a bee. Wow. God damn Sorry, Rob. Riveting. I know, <laughs> that's why I didn't want to say it, because it's the stupidest shit to bring up. I'm just um, filling I've air been... until somebody has a better one. Yeah, no, I don't think I have a good one. Like, I don't have anything that is crazy interesting that happened. I'm a boring dude. Oh, I okay, no, I got a better don't. one. Yeah. I got a better one. Okay, never have I ever almost drowned and played it off like nothing happened. Oh my god. That's what? too specific <laughs> to say <laughs> no. That's very specific, so, you, all right, so tell the story then. Uh, I almost drowned and played it off like nothing but happened. But why? Like, yeah. why did you play it off like nothing happened? And why did you almost drown? Okay, I was in a swimming pool, I was a little kid. And I was hanging out with my friend who's a bit older, so I guess it was a little bit of that, like, sort of watch out for your younger brother kind of mentality, I guess. Mm -hmm. And he, I guess, noticed that I had slipped off into the deep end and couldn't get myself up above the water. But I was, like, kind of low-key, like, floundering without it seeming like I was in trouble. Mm. And so I was under there for, like, a little longer than I think was reasonable, but I wasn't struggling yet. And he just noticed it in time, just like, just yanked me over, and I was like, oh, yeah, no, I was fine. No, I'll no problems. I'll be waving my hand. I had a weird, like, semi-drowning situation when I was younger. I could have um, died, though, if he didn't move me. <laughs> I was, uh, I was swimming in a pool, and we had this big, like, one of those things you drag behind a boat, like, going really fast. Um, body. It's a body. Yeah, you dragging bodies. Dra okay. Dexter. Yep. It's not, it's no, like an uh, inner tube? Crap. Yeah, well, like, like an inner tube, but like huge. Like okay. one of the ones you put a bunch of people in. Oh, outer okay, tube yeah, yeah. dragged behind a boat. And uh, we had that in the pool for some reason. And I was like, just like, I had just learned how to swim. Like I was four or five or something. I don't know. And I was swimming and I, I guess I tried to swim underneath it. And I was like a d stupid, dumb kid. So when I came oh. up for air, I just hit the bottom of it. Oh, and yeah. I, it was like, oh no, I'm going to drown now. So I kept trying to come up and I kept getting like mouthfuls of water because I couldn't find the like it was literally like you know six feet across but I was small and a child and I could not get out from underneath it luckily eventually I did and I was pissed off because when I came up literally like coughing and gasping for air everyone just started clapping what? <laughs> <laughs> and I was Were like they just making fun of you I don't know I don't remember why but everyone was clapping like hey he did it and I'm sitting there like <laughs> That is clapping. weird as shit. And That's I was, hilarious. I learned a valuable lesson that day. Uh, if I ever drown, uh, I don't think I'm, anyone's going to come help. Dude, I have like <laughs> almost the same story. We used to, like, really? my friend uh, used to have his birthday party. His parents were divorced, which was sick. Because, like, he had two houses, right? So, like... <laughs> I'm just joking, but his but parents were calling divorced. Calling it sick was just a bit odd. To me. <laughs> no, but his dad, like, I don't know if he had gone through like a midlife crisis or something, but his mom lived in like a very sensible house in like the country, and his dad was like, "I live on the lake. Have your birthday parties here, and we'll like go out on my pontoon boat every birthday, right? And cook burgers cool. for everybody because nice. I'm a cool dad. <laughs> he was a pretty cool dad. But then, like, we'd always go out on his dad's pontoon boat." Uh, to swim, and it was one of the ones that had like two, almost like skates, you know, like it had two flotation devices on the side, and then underneath yep. there was like a little air pocket. I know that one. So mm -hmm. kids would like jump in in the middle of the lake off the boat. They'd swim underwater, get into the space where there's air, and then come up in between the two flotation devices and then swim under the other flotation device and be safe. But then like I was always like I don't really want to do that because it seems like unnecessary risk of my life. But then one time I was yeah. like fuck it, you know, live a little. And then I, I went down, and when I surfaced, I hit my head on the flotation device, just like aluminum. And then I was like, okay, I guess, like, I'm just going to die now. So just, like, with my eyes closed, I just kept swimming, like, a little longer until I thought I couldn't hold my breath at all anymore. And then I, I finally surfaced.
And then I was like 50 meters away from the boat. And everyone was like, what the fuck? And I was like, yeah, no big deal. <laughs> Almost I mean, died. So it wasn't that strange of a story for me to have that because we've all had one apparently. <laughs> I think of that I sometimes mean, when I'm like, you know, if you like buy a pool, a pool is sweet. But it is also one of those like household devices where you're like, there's probably like a 1% chance you die in that. Or someone yeah. dies in it. Yeah, I guess you're right. Whoa! Oh. Ah. But there's gotta be other ah. ones. Right? Trampolines. I don't yeah. think it, that's more likely to like hurt you. Yeah, but like. Yeah, no, you're right. But there is a pretty decent chance you smash your head on the ground. I, I think yeah, that. If you have... a, are you gonna say with a basketball net attached to it? Yeah, and <laughs> on uh, and on a basketball court, and then jumping without helmets. Right. Yeah, that's a big problem. <laughs> yeah. Um, but your your school didn't encourage that. <laughs> oh, Steven. <laughs> I forgot about Steve. <laughs> did they clap for you? They did not. Why are they always clapping? It's so weird. If Kate and I had a ah! pool, I would be totally fine with it. But if uh, if we had like a young kid and we had a pool, I would be like, nah. That's getting closed up until they're like 10. <laughs> well, yeah, that's probably fair, honestly. Chat's having a problem about the whole helmets with trampolines thing. We weren't suggesting you wear them in regular trampolines. Just if you're on a basketball court. Yeah, yeah. only if the trampoline's on a basketball court. People yeah, do so. that to dunk the ball and slam they ball. get really hurt. Mm -hmm. You, you get clam ball? Slam ball! <laughs> oh, <laughs> slam. <laughs> I like clam ball, though. wonder what those slam ball players are doing these days. They're probably all dead. I don't think they're all dead. Ah. I think every single one of them is dead. You know what's terrifying? Slam Wave ball players? Pools. Wave, wave pools? Oh, yeah. I've, I've never been, been in, in a wave once. pool. They're cool, I don't think they're terrifying. They're, no, they're terrifying because if someone's drowning, you're not going to fucking see them. Yeah. I don't know how those yeah. lifeguards do. Like, I saw a lifeguard jump in one time at a wave pool, and he pulled some guy, and everyone was just kind of looking around like, how did they see that person? That person was drowning, and none of us saw it. Special like, talent. It's it's crazy insane because like if you go down into the water, there's so many people in that pool just bobbing up and yeah. down. It's almost you're not able to see them. Can you believe yeah. that lifeguarding is a job that we trust to mostly like 14 year old kids? Yeah, like that's well, amazing. And yet I don't feel bad about it either. Yeah, I mean, there, I've, when I when you go to beaches in New York, the lifeguards are usually like you know in their 20s. And usually very ripped. Oh, as of well. course, yeah. Yeah. You gotta be ripped. I guess so, yeah. Is that. People are saying that's not true. That's not true. Maybe that's just how they do it up here. I mean, okay, I mean, 14's you, a little young. But you gotta understand. No, that's an actual job. You gotta like, understand that as a 28 year old. Community pool. As a 28 year old, 17 year olds are 14 to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Fuck. I'm not saying it's right. I'm just saying that's how it is in my head. You ever seen those livestock trucks that they like transport about a thousand cows in the back of like two semis? Yeah. And they usually do like a double decker situation and all the cows or pigs or, or whatever livestock, they basically can't move at all. And the situation is that if one of them falls down or lays down intentionally, they often just have to kill them. What? And that's Why? what I think of when I think of a wave pool. What? That's nature killing you as <laughs> livestock because you laid down. You guys you know, I never really thought about yeah, it. Yeah, no, way. you know, I, <laughs> you know, agree to disagree, I suppose. They, uh, well, the problem is that they thrash around. Like when the the guy that's trying to transport him needs to get him back up, they just put up a whole fucking problem, mm. and they end up injuring other yeah. animals. And so it's easier to just kill them and drag them out. Jesus. Yeah, it's fucked up, right? Sometimes... I learned this from the Australian Trucker Show. <laughs> oh, sometimes fuck. I wish I was an animal, and other times I'm really happy I'm not an animal. What are the times that you do? <laughs> when do you want to be an animal? Like Ask if I want a friend. Like being, <laughs> <laughs> like being like I don't know, like a dope bird or something, or like being hey, what's like your top dope, dope bird. bird. <laughs> dope like, bird. like probably like an eagle or something. You know, Dude, you I think eagles have to fly eagle around for garbage days. all day. I think if people <laughs> went like, "What's the worst bird to be?" Most people's knee-jerk reaction would be like pigeon. You're yeah. so wrong. Vulture. Being a pigeon would actually be dope as hell. 
You ever seen like New York? Well, you're like a big city pigeon. They're always like so fat and they're eating like french fries off the sidewalk. That's as good as it gets in bird life, yeah. man. I mean, that's true, but in New York, we also have a population of peregrine falcons that are oh, there yeah. to uh, fucking like murder them. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've seen them fucking like snatch a fucking pigeon up and eat it. And it's just like, I don't wanna, I don't wanna- I heard they can world. snap their necks as they grab them. Yeah, I think so. It's pretty fucked up, man. <laughs> no, that's like not fucked up. That's no, I mean it's not, but it's nice like quick. You think yeah, you're fine, and then you're just dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'd rather it that than them like rip out your entrails and eat you while you're yeah. alive. That's or, what the or, cat would do. Like how an oh shit, how an <laughs> eagle does it too. I've seen a video of an eagle pick up a goat, yeah, climb him up a mountain and drop yeah. him off a cliff. Like that's fucked up. Drop it. I've <laughs> I've seen that video with the wombo combo commentary overlaid in the background. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Happy feet. Wombo combo. <laughs> that ain't Falco. That ain't Falco. <laughs> it's so good. It's a metal as fuck way to die though. That's still better than like eating. Like getting eaten alive is like the worst. Yeah. Yeah. I height. Yeah, it's gonna suck for five seconds, but at least it's not gonna suck for like twenty minutes. Well, you know, yeah. like, do you rather the eagle feeds you to its babies or to drop you? Because I think I would rather be dropped. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Well, I mean, dropped. Yeah. There's something really creepy about knowing that as you die, you're becoming food. And it's very oh, like, painful. I think it's just the painful part is probably the only part you're gonna be thinking about. Can you imagine oh, being yeah. like a I'm getting eaten by things right now? That kind of sucks. Uh, no, <laughs> be like, I'm thinking ah! about being beheaded again. <laughs> Can't stop. Stop thinking about being beheaded. I keep stopping. Like, God damn it! Stop it! I don't. I don't mind. Like in my head, it's not existentially terrifying for like something to swoop out of the air and grab me and just snap my neck. Like I mean, it would suck, <laughs> but then like at least it's over quickly. You ever see like videos of a pack of lions hunting down a gazelle? Yeah. Yeah. And there's like gazelle is just like running from eight lions. You're like, come on. Even in your head, you got to know how this goes. But not <laughs> only are you gonna get eaten, but the way it's gonna go is they're gonna like nip off a piece of your leg first. You're gonna be running like a half dead already until you just decide that you'd rather die than keep running. It's and so yeah. depressing seeing an animal get caught by a predator and they just they just give up and they just sit there. They're all yeah. sad because they're just dead, and they, it's like the most depressing thing. I, I, I saw this one video of like a group, a family oh. of lions eating a water buffalo. The motherfucker was still alive. He was just laying down while they were just chewing at his belly and yeah. his neck. He was like, he, he was just kind of like wetting them because I mean, I don't, I think well, he what was are you gonna disabled. do? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> like, I'll take the what, next I'm sure what they a bitch. like to stop them. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucked, man. Yeah, oh. why are we talking about this? This is the most depressing <laughs> shit of all time. Yeah, did you guys know that all puppies die? Well, <laughs> not that's not confirmed yet. Uh, not true anymore. <laughs> but they all go to heaven as well. Yes. That's, so uh, that's yeah, pretty okay. sad. Uh, yeah. No, you they the debunked that actually. How it, how it does its shit, right? Yeah, <laughs> they infect you with a nasty disease. They literally bite you once, die. and they poison you, and they just wait next to you for a week as they watch <laughs> you die. And then and they, they come you. and, like, give you shit while you're dying, too. Like, they'll yeah. come and just kind of taunt you for a while. I mean, it's pretty sick. Like, you always got to remind yourself, as human beings, we're very abstracted from the concept that life is really just a competition to steal something else's carbon. Like... Yeah. We're just here playing video games like, oh, well, that game had a shitty patch, you know, and like, <laughs> deep down inside, life is just, you know, is trying to steal resources from other life. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Gosh. Good job. <laughs> like, you know, like, it, we're like 20 nuclear bombs away from being either that gazelle or part of that pack of lions. Like, yeah. that's, that's the only thing Wait, separating us from the beast. We won't be the gazelle, we'll just be dust. Well, I mean, <laughs> I'm I'm planning on giving it my all. Okay. You guys like delicious rock dust? <laughs> Don't. Yeah, salt is very good, Rob. Yes, salt. Is very I know, good. right? <laughs> Have you ever heard of the term that we death eat positive materials? No. Wait, death not positive? Heard of that? What is that? Yeah, oh, death positive. That? I read an article band? this morning. No, it's not actually, but it sounds like one. It does. Uh, Confirmed. An article about trying to destigmatize death in our culture, and I just figured that was a good segue because we we're talking about it already. Uh, and they used the term death positive. And I was like, man, this is a term that I did not think needed to exist at all. 
at all. I, like, what is it? So it's you... referring to a person who speaks of death in a manner as to make it less frightening. That it, you know, to naturalize death, to normalize it. That sounds stupid. I hate when people <laughs> go like, you know. Oh, you know, death is just like a process. You know, you can't have life without. What do you know? Like, <laughs> just you're just like, like a <laughs> you're a customer <laughs> service representative at like HP. What do you mean death is a process? Oh, I, as much as I hate that term, I also do kind of agree that it's a good idea. But like, did we need a term for it at all? Yeah, I don't there know. You go. Yeah. Like, what? Dying with That'll dignity. Dying with dignity is a great way to put it. Yeah, that's okay. I, I agree I'm with like that. Yeah, but like nobody dies with dignity. You shit after that's you not, die. Like, I think you can die with dignity. You can once die with dead, more it dignity. It doesn't matter. No. Dignity it's only not... happens until you're dead. Once you're dead and you poop, you're not there anymore. It's not your dignity anymore. Yeah, I think I that's true. So, yeah. The question is about dignity. It's it's are you on your own terms? Yes. Because anyone who's like, oh yeah, he died with no dignity because he shit himself after he died. Yeah, that's just petty as hell. That, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Everybody shits themselves a few times. It's like not a big deal. That's true. Everybody shit themselves in their life. But it's Chat, funny because it is kind of like a parabolic curve, right? You start life shitting yourself. You end life shitting yourself. Mm -hmm. Sometimes in college, it, ja it jacks back up a little bit. Yeah. Never have I ever shit my pants as an adult. Oh. I feel like you'd only bring it up if the answer if you was have no. It. I, yeah, I, no, I you, well, yeah, I'm not gonna out myself as a pants shitter. Like that would be. <laughs> I, I don't even think that it's something you need to feel ashamed about because people get sick. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's 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 what happened to me. I got I got really sick and I accidentally shit myself. It so happens, like, man. yeah, it's not like you you needed a cover. I didn't cares. do it on purpose. Yeah, it's not like, like that, I'm just, that's that a good point. Defending? Yeah. Did you shit your pants on purpose? Yeah, I guess that's the other <laughs> thing. Like if I was just like sitting in, in my box and was like, ah, I don't want to go to the bathroom and just take a dump on my bed. <laughs> oh. like, you know. It's like that Adam Sandler movie. A little kid pisses himself and he pisses himself too. You just do it with shitting. <laughs> Can we talk about? I saw yesterday. Oh, I've never seen Click, but I have seen the DVD cover. Yeah. So on the DVD cover, it's Adam Sandler. He's got like a smug little Sandler-esque smile, yeah. right? Right. He's holding the controller. Yeah. yeah. And all the buttons say things like, you know, skip a uh, boring meeting, fast forward, working out, you know? The right. one, the button that says rewind says rewind to prom night. Now, I don't want to oh! necessarily <laughs> offer up any like strange questions about this. But is it weird for a 40-year-old man's brain to fuck a 17-year-old? <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit. Cause like, I mean, but he's prom. sometimes, sometimes. <laughs> no, but that he's so fixated on it that he thinks it needs to be on his clicker remote, on the cover of his DVD. Yeah, that's a good point. And like, also, would that be the thing. Is it fair that you have an experienced 38-year-old man's dick? In the body of an 18-year-old. <laughs> Wait a he's, minute. He's fucking up every college guy's ability to impress this lady. He's got mm. like 20 years of experience. Oh, you're saying he's salt in the earth. I'm, exactly. He's, you know, oh, it's your first meal on planet Earth. I'm going to take you to, you know... The candy the, shop. Yeah, I can let you like a lollipop. Let me lick my lollipop, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm pretty Wait, sure, it, though... That might be right. It might be time to stop. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if this makes it worse. Okay. But I think in the movie, when he rewinds, he doesn't actually relive it. He just watches it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, he doesn't actually watch that part, I don't think. But that's it, when he does rewind. It doesn't like a movie. make it better, necessarily. But I'm not sure if it makes it worse. I mean... I can't parse my opinion on this. No. <laughs> Is it wrong to remember the things that you've done when you're? Oh, when you're I don't know. I, that's the thing. I don't know. <laughs> now we're getting into some. Yeah, this is like this is existential. Oh, but he's married to the girl he went to prom with. Well, that, that, okay, but by by your rationale, that doesn't make it. <laughs> yeah, but it, but it's like, like sort of sweet now. 
I don't know. By, by it... your rationale, that does not make it better. I don't know. I think it makes it <laughs> better. That makes it worse. No. He's like, oh yeah, remember how hot my my wife was when she was a teenager? But it would be worse if it was a different. <laughs> if it'd be worse <laughs> if it was a different person, I think. Can I, I guess equally so, yeah. as bad. I feel like it's just <laughs> equally as bad. He's not done it. Oh, oh, oh. oh. He's Blue done it. He's gotcha. done it. It's not worse, but it's definitely not better. I can live with that. Yeah. I, oh, by the way, I wanted to answer a question. Yes, yeah, sharding, sharding counts as shitting yourself. Oh, no doubt, yeah. Yeah. You don't have to push out a whole log to count. Yeah, exactly. You know, if there's one drop of urine in your water, that's piss water. Mm hmm exactly. It doesn't need that's a like whole if stream. If there's one stock of asparagus in your water, it's asparagus <laughs> water, whether you want it or not. <laughs> oh, You know, no. a lot of people lost their jobs for that, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Whoa, that diagonal arrow almost got me. Look, I'm just saying, of all the- he could rewind to, like, his children's birth. But the button on the remote, it took one thing. They were, like, in the room. They're like, what would- what would this man want to rewind to the most in his life? Wedding day, birth of his well, child, you know. Your presumption, what if it was just he wants to relive meeting her for the first time and dancing with her? Yeah! You don't meet someone for the first time at prom, though. What kind of proms did you go to? Yeah, you had to ask him out to go to prom. What if it was just a special night where- I don't know, man. You're what made it so little... special? Good call. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> the, uh... I completely lost what I was going to say. Never mind. Go on. Alright, alright. I mean, that's basically the end. Alright. I, I just saw, like, of all the things, I was like, man, that's a little... It's a little weird. Oh, you... yeah, that's what I was going to talk about. Childbirth. So, yeah. I've never experienced childbirth. No obviously. kidding. Good. Well, technically uh, not it? true, because, yeah. you well, know. <laughs> I mean, okay. But, uh, hey. You know, people always talk about, you know, it's like this magical, beautiful thing and stuff. Yeah. And, you know, maybe, maybe, you know, maybe, maybe that's true, and maybe I'm, it's just because I've never experienced it myself, but, like, you know, I've seen Miracle of Life. They showed <laughs> yeah. me that. Yeah. And, like, she's, like, shitting all over herself, and there's just, like, blood and everything yep. everywhere. It's like... There's, like, egg whites coming out and, like, yeah. jelly monsters. <laughs> like, I understand it's a natural biological egg process, whites. and it's beautiful in a conceptual level, but, like, I don't know. I feel like if I watch that the one time, I'll be good. You know what Do I mean? Do you think a lot of, like, like, the person that's in with them, like, just vomits? You think that ever happens? They're like, oh, I, I can't... Oh, it probably happened. Has. Yeah, I think I that they doubt. say it's beautiful because once it's all nice and cleaned up and you see your thing yeah. that you made for the first yeah, time. Yeah. Swaddle the shit out of that thing. Yeah, that I mean that would be nice. But the other the other part where you wanna if you'd wanna relive your child's birth, I don't think I'd really wanna do that, to be honest. Oh, but prom night's fine. People record it on this their <laughs> video. How many, man. But more people throw up on prom night than throw up on the child's birth. Ah shit. Um I don't know if that's true. Probably. Do you ever think that, like, women are always, like, childbirth is Nagging, so... Right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> They're always like, oh my god, childbirth is so hard. And then you're like, well, you know, as a man, when you experience pain, it's painful. And they go, but you don't know what it's like. But they don't know what it's like. Mm, maybe. Yeah. I'm not saying childbirth is not painful. But maybe it's not that painful and they're all yeah. just babies <laughs> you know i agree it is much uh, harder being a man <laughs> yeah we definitely deserve a lot more credit for the things that we do than we get uh, we should really make a platform about that i'm just saying <laughs> I, like i hate this Ooh. <laughs> uh, no this is i mean i stubbed my toe other day and it was really bad yeah yeah. I'm the, it looks painful. I'm not gonna disagree with you on that one. But hey, when I broke my toe, dude, yeah. I mean, I've had testicular sucks. surgery. What? What? Really? Yeah. How did you not know that? I didn't know that. When I didn't did, know that either. When did that happen? What? I was like, were you born yesterday? Twelve years yeah. ago. Oh, this is like fuck. NL fact number Ugh. six on the list. Ah. Oh! I learned just... about hydro seals because of this guy. Yeah, exactly. hydro seal. I had a hydro seal. 
It's a fluid. That... Oh god. It's a fluid <laughs> filled like, sack. Your balls? Yeah, exactly. And the doctor was like, "Hey, your balls are like pretty big." And I was like, Ev "Not everyone's are like this." And he's like, "Nah, dude, this is crazy." And I was like, "All right." Thanks. And then yeah, he was like, and he left. We well, he's like, you know, <laughs> you can take that right out for it if you want. I was like, let's do it. Oh yeah. my god, six six six. Hillstem. I think uh, you said it pretty recently in an Isaac video, yeah. and I think you said it almost the same way you just said it there. Wow. Well. So yeah. That's pretty crazy. I, I mean, understand. <laughs> I'm, again, I'm learning a lot more about your balls, like, every NLSS. There's yeah. not that much to know, if I'm being honest, like... Well, I mean, Kate said they're hairy, now you have water Well, that's just what you'd expect, right? <laughs> water in your balls? <laughs> Operation! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, old mansion's pretty good. Uh, old mansion. Apparently, a kidney stone is the closest men can get to feeling the yeah, birth of uh, who, pain of birth. Who, uh, who did that study? Probably yeah, right. a woman, is what I'm saying. <laughs> Don't do it, don't do wow. it, don't do it, don't do it! Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Nobody I mean, had the courage I... to say it but you. One thing I will oh, say I'm is getting hit in the nuts really sucks. Like, yeah, it's not very pleasant. Yeah. Like, it's definitely not as bad as childbirth, probably. But, like, that sucks. Why didn't we, like, get hit in the vagina is not great either, I've heard. So. Yeah. I like, it's, oh. <laughs> like, why didn't it be like, oh, this this lady, uh, you know, she, because people die during child, uh, childbirth, 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 childbirth still. Like, <laughs> why, we didn't uh, get rid uh, of that. How do people do do it during a uh, turtle birth though? <laughs> turtle bird. Is that gonna work? How's your turtle bird? <laughs> yep, that works. That's weird. Nice. I like it. Whoa, no, wait, I'm no, no, actually. No, no, no. I'm actually oh, like a far. million percent with you, Austin. That like no, but it, like it, it didn't work for me. Childbirth is forward. like oh, it's the worst <laughs> like evolutionary. Well, good enough. Like we'll fix this later. <laughs> sort of feature. It's like it's horrifying for almost every creature. Well, eggs. You know, eggs. I man. mean, to quote my bioethics course in yes. uh, is my bioethics 101 in uh, in college. Yeah. Um, you didn't have to say it was in college. You know, I know you well, went to an alternative high school, so I didn't think they <laughs> offered a bioethics course. <laughs> my point is, I I am aware that I know very little about this topic. Okay. So yeah. anyway, um, we we could do artificial wounds and like you know incubate babies basically in there after the baby's been conceived. Right. It's yeah. just people have an ethical concern with it. But then you wouldn't have any childbirth complications if it was in an artificial yeah. womb. I mean, awesome. yeah, but what, what if the, the power went out? you just employed in that last round, by the way? My, uh, my thing's not spinning. The, the elbow below me is, oh, is not okay. it's decent. Yeah, my, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, were, you were super laggy for me. Because um, I wanted you guys to experience what I had to do. He's not. <laughs> No, I still can't do that. How did you? How? How? What? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Wait, you guys just both died in it for no reason on my screen. Well, Over. they'd have auxiliary power, NL. All right. Well. Oh! No, stop pushing me. <gasps> He's done it. So I found out recently they're developing these jelly robots that you can actually swallow, and they can stay in your stomach and diagnose illnesses. And I was wondering if maybe later in life, when they get those to be very stable over a long period of time, would you just like have a no. jelly robot living in you for diagnose diagnostic purposes? Yes. Yeah. Why not? Yeah, me robot. too. I would love a jelly robot in my belly. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't yeah. Want a jelly robot in my belly. Why not? I was. Because <laughs> it's gross. <laughs> I uh, I was watching a video yesterday. What do you mean about... a jelly bot? Did you, did you guys see the video on Reddit of the yeah. blowjob robot? Yes, it was horrifying! <laughs> yeah, I didn't fucking, see it, but... It was fucking hilarious! Oh. It, it was... looked like a bag lady, and then they took the stuff off, and it was just like a weird metal foot plate. <laughs> if, you want, if you want a blowjob from a homeless lady from Alaska, then this, <laughs> this robot's for you. But if not, then you gotta go somewhere else. Was, no, do you remember the phrasing when he said it was like a... Yeah. Toe curling suction. <laughs> That's one of yeah. them. The yeah. other was what he called it when it was turned up as fast as it goes. <laughs> he used a specific word in the description that I'm now losing. I don't remember. It's it's fucking. It, it was like skin stripping, like something 
Something that looks like you don't want to do that to your dick. <laughs> I just, just it's, hate this. It's so weird, too. There's like a little... So, when he says toe curling suction... <laughs> There's a hole in the back you of her neck the, you gotta yeah. cover with your thumb. <laughs> you, put your, you put your finger on the hole and it She's makes like suction. A flute. Shit out of here. It's so creepy. But see... But this is what I mean about, like, men don't have cool sex toys, because that's just horrifying! Damn it! That's terrifying! No it one is. would want to do that! Really? Also, did you read the fucking comments below that video? Because no, they were actually. all like, Guess what, women? Your time's coming. You better start getting useful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Alright, I don't know why I'm making you wait, because I'm gonna die, like, right now, probably. Yeah. All right. You guys got a problem but with anyway, this level? Yeah. That thing was horrifying. And then that led me into watching another video about um that you know that company that makes those things called the uh, real dolls? Oh yeah. 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 Those are those are terrifying. I watched a documentary and, on that actually. Yeah. Well, it was a video about they they were making a, a sex robot um but it's it's just the real doll body with an animatronic head. I don't and like it's, it. it's so uncanny valley. It's, it's a little. Like, it's it's too like much. Mass Effect Andromeda. Or yeah, well, like <laughs> the the whatever. <gasps> what's that band that plays at like Shakey's Pizza? The animatronic. Oh, oh yeah, the yeah, horrifying yeah, right, murder yeah. bear. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they got their own oh, horror game no! series. It's called Five Nights at Fuck. Freddy's. Yeah. But anyway, that thing is, is is scary. The YouTube video, the dude's like, "Yeah, could I could I like put my my fingers in her mouth?" And he's like, "Oh yeah, you could totally do that." Like, I and, and it, like my friend. <laughs> and she's just like creepily like she's got like those this weird like early two thousands video game animation faces. <laughs> so like it's just oh man, it's horrifying. My friend doesn't believe me, but I got one in the shape of Lara Croft. <laughs> Fuck off. Do you think God Nerds. stays in heaven because he <laughs> what we created? <laughs> you know we're like fucked though, right? Like there's I mean oh, fuck. we're not fucked as like a species, like we'll probably be fine, maybe. But like yeah. societally, there's already like a a large population of people uh, males specifically, m -m -m males uh, in, <laughs> in, in, in in Japan that have like opted out. They're like, you know, it's like all this like dating and marriage stuff. That doesn't seem like my cup of tea. So I'm just gonna like right. not do that, and instead, I'm just gonna like do whatever I want like all the time, <laughs> and just jerk off. And I yeah. mean like, yeah. that's that's the, come on, that's part of it. <laughs> like let's be honest. And then. The, uh, like right now, that's just with porn and, I don't know, like, animated who knows what, right? But then, yeah. when we get, like, functional sex robots, that's gonna be, like, 50% of the population. They're gonna be like, why would I ever deal with anything uncomfortable Yeah. when I could just yeah. fuck my sex robot right now? Yeah, humans are fucked. It's, it's all over, yeah. really. The, uh, the comment section I talked about with the blowjob robot. So I said there was like a ton that were like, watch out women, your time has come. The other was like, bring the nukes now, we need to talk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's probably true. The, uh, yeah, well, you know, what we'll do at that point, because, you know, human innovation and all that, is uh, we'll just harvest the semen from the sex robots and use in vitro fertilization to continue the species. Oh! Wait, the, yeah. the robots have semen in them now? I feel well, like... Well, that's the... <laughs> you see, when a man loves a robot, or at least is attracted to the factory-produced factory, factory when produced a man visage... Loves a robot, <laughs> I feel like... I, but, like... No, we won't, though. I, I actually right. agree with you. Yeah. That, like, it's probably gonna be, like, pretty minor, but it's sort of fun to think about. Mm hmm Yeah, it's the, just gonna be bad if, like, if, like, for race. some reason, the people that really like sex robots are the ones that we really need to pass their genes on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, oh. <laughs> That's like a genetic fatal flaw. That's like a 404 error. It's like he's real. Well, you know, 
He's really, really smart. He's considerate. Um, you know, he's he's good with people, but he just loves fucking that robot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's nothing wrong with fucking a robot, I guess. Can probably. You just see the mom knocking on the door. Jimmy, stop fucking the robot and come downstairs. Well, for that's dinner. just like, well, it's your 14th birthday, Slugger. What do you want? <laughs> yeah, right. I want a sex robot, Dad. <laughs> well, it is that time. Can you? <laughs> I mean, can you say no, really? Well, I guess we Actually, should... I made his voice a little too high for Yeah, that was weird. Honest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. Alright. Would you guys get a sex robot? No. Would no. you get a sex robot in this? Uh, well, let's say, like, well, hold on, but like, let's, we have to be specific, like... Okay, fine, we'll do one more. Is it a good one or not? <laughs> oh, well, yeah, it's like... A, <laughs> it's a perfect one-to-one -one. One -one recreation of a human being. But then you have a sex robot in well, your life. Is it a is it a one to one creation of a human being in the sense that it has like autonomy and consciousness and like? Well, no. <laughs> Will it jump off a cliff if you tell it? To right. You? Yeah. Exactly. No oh, spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've been watching that a little bit recently. <laughs> but um, oh. you know, it it uh, it 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 have. You know, as much autonomy as you decide. See, they, no, have. just I don't want the choice because that's t already in horrifying territory. <laughs> it's like Pinocchio, you know. I you go, you go make it as brain dead creepy. as you want. It's just your Why cum is dumpster. <laughs> Why is it like Pinocchio? It's dick grows if you lie to it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. Th I don't think I would. Yeah, it'd be weird. I, I trust it'd myself be weird. to use it responsibly, but no, I don't think I would either. Yeah. So that's why I don't think it'd be a problem. We're all sensible. Can we go adults, back to right? I trust myself to use it responsibly. <laughs> what yeah. in the world yeah, does that mean? <laughs> I mean, there is the chance for some people that they would spiral into a world where oh. any human relationship loses all meaning. Those yeah. are the people you're talking about earlier. I don't right. believe I would become one of those people ultimately. Yeah. Oh, come on. So that's the, the responsible part, is I don't okay. want to be one of those people. Yeah, that's fair. But what if it also, like, did your dishes and cooked for you? <laughs> I worry sometimes because of my love of automation and streamlining things that eventually I could put myself in a position where the sum total of my life is to do absolutely nothing. So I think I do have to draw the line a bit early and say I'd rather do the dishes myself. That's why I'm always stunned that you guys are the ones that are concerned about efficiency. <laughs> what do you mean? Like, yeah, what do you mean by that? The, the absurd commitment to, like, making seven peanut butter and jelly sandwiches on <laughs> one day You're to so maximize... about that. I'm like, don't, don't take this the wrong way, but you guys aren't, like, the chief of medicine at New York General Hospital. Like that was what? none of us though. Well, that was like the chat and bear. It was Nick. <laughs> what did I do? You were the one talking about making a week's worth of PJ sandwiches and then putting them in the fridge. I wasn't even implying I was gonna do it myself. I was explaining why Bear would do it. Hmm. Yeah. I'm just saying this bizarre commitment to efficiency at all costs, and then the time just goes if into you're the ether. A sex robot. You're not efficient. <laughs> It would be, no, it'd be more efficient to just cut your balls off. Exactly. I don't. Please, I mean, right. by like what efficiency metric, though? Look, if you're taking time out of your day to fuck every day, you're losing a lot of time to fucking. That's not efficient. Yeah. yeah. If we're talking strictly efficiency. <laughs> Did you just say that if you're taking all your time to fuck, then you're losing your time to fuck? Yeah. No, your time to do anything else. You should just fuck oh. for three and a half hours once a week and then store up the pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> Release it a little at a time every hour. Yeah. Oh, fuck. That's yeah, true. Fucking a robot probably would take longer than jerking off. Yeah. You'd have to get it all ready. Robot? Yeah, then you, you have to like, pull out you have to clean it now? Now there's more yeah. questions. Of course, of you, have course you have to clean it. Then yeah, fuck no. That's just... You gotta open up her belly, and it's like a it's like a vacuum cleaner that has the plastic. Uh... No, it doesn't go that far in. <laughs> the uh, oh, the, that's where they the keep low the job robot, you had to pull out like the back of her neck or something. I think there was just like a cum catcher in there. Watch out, ladies! 
This just got <laughs> way worse. <laughs> Once Dude, they fix the cum catcher, I've got no reason for you anymore. Cum catcher in the rye. <laughs> Once they iron out the structural inefficiencies of the foot pedal, your time has come. <laughs> Watch out, oh, ladies. Man. Can, but can you deal with, like, other people having a better sex robot? Like, you're fucking your Model 1, right? And you're thinking, yeah. oh, this is pretty good. And then Elon Musk is on stage with his, like, Model S. And you're like, oh, come on. <laughs> his nuts are way better. <laughs> Did you guys hear about this egg thing? Freaking... Mm. Yeah, it's Northern Lights. No, it's like a Tanga egg or something. Tanga. Oh, okay. yeah, that's the disposable fleshlight. It's an egg men. that you fuck and you just throw away. It's just like a jelly egg. Why? I think you get like six So you don't five. have to clean something. Mm. No, I mean, I get that, but why would you want a fucking egg? <laughs> cool. it's, no, it's not what it's about called. what it looks like. It just yeah. happens to be shaped like an egg. I see. Why didn't they make it shaped like a vagina? Yeah. Because that's really more work, and it's before. conspicuous. <laughs> it's more you conspicuous! Wanna, <laughs> you want to be able to leave the eggs out on your kitchen table, and nobody will be worried about what you're going to fuck with it. Wait, does it actually just look like an egg, so like if you bring a lady home, she'll try to like make you breakfast, and then, you know, find out you have a pocket vagina? No, it's not like a convincing-looking egg. Mm. It's shaped like an egg, but it, you wouldn't mistake it for an egg. So you wouldn't put it in your fruit bowl? <laughs> Why would you put an egg in your fruit bowl what you're into, to I guess. begin with? <laughs> well, sometimes you just want a raw egg, you know? In your fruit bowl. I worry in your about fruit bowl, yeah. you all sometimes. <laughs> you the least of all, Austin. But I appreciate that. <laughs> oh, fuck. Still Do a I... little, though. Should be a lot more. So yeah, that's the tanga egg. Ah! You can get that right now if you I want. I don't really want a fucking egg, to be honest. Oh, come on. Oh, you're, you're not really... going to have a choice soon. But why no. not, though? Because it's an egg. And no, it's... but, like, it doesn't matter, though. Like, it's not supposed to look appealing. It's just supposed to be something you put your dick in. How big yeah, is the like, egg, though? Like, I don't know. Enough for a dick? Because I'm picturing, the like, the shape of an egg. Yeah, but the size of a normal egg. Like, I'm not trying yeah. to put on airs here. It's not going to cover yeah. the entire erect phallus. It's not meant to. Yeah. It's just it's probably big enough, all right? So it's like it's a, a little, little dip and a little dab. If it's, if it's a, a sex toy your... that exists and is sold frequently, it's probably big enough. You're only getting half of your pole wet? You might well, only need the head stretches. to be wet, to be honest. Chat's saying it stretches. I don't it's like very that you guys stretchy. know that, but... Oh. When it I stretches, like it, does it, it go like... Does it make a slide whistle noise? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it, like, it, doesn't, it doesn't feel like a vagina, right? It feels like whatever that egg feels like. But what so if like, it feels, it feels like silicon? Can we know? Yeah. There's a female living in this house. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Did you just beat your wife? What <laughs> That's not funny. She <laughs> she stubbed her toe on the uh, on my chair on my hot ass DX racer. It's because you're driving so fast you couldn't Beep. stop it in time. <laughs> Scared. <laughs> oh, that was in freaking harmony on my. Yeah, end. that was pretty amazing. Synchronized skirting. I'm just saying, <laughs> like it sounded from the audio log, that was like. Uh, you know there's a woman in this house. Ow! <laughs> Ow! The portal wasn't active. Alright, well that's enough. Anyway. <laughs> it was enough 30 minutes ago. Yeah. So what's Kate gonna play? Mmm, that's a good question. Kate, what are you gonna play on your show? She said, Heroes of the Storm, if people want to play with her. Ah. I'll play Dota. Ah, uh, no, don't do that, dude. Come on now. Yeah, let's get back into Dota. <laughs> the time oh. is right. Oh. I need to play some Sven. Yeah, <laughs> Sven's pretty fun. He's, He's got a targeted stun. Sword. <laughs> we can't even. Look, the, the game's changed so much. We can't make. Yeah. Comments like that. He could have a fucking, like, AoE stun now for all we know. What? Wait. Didn't I mean, it know? is AoE, but yeah, I mean, targetable <laughs> AoE. Look, I was just trying to make whatever. Wait, no, but it is a targetable AoE as well. No, but, like, an area, you target the, an area and stun the people in the ah, area. Look, gotcha. it doesn't matter. The point <laughs> was that Dota changes frequently. 
you could have, you could have used another example. <laughs> it was a bad one, I'll admit, but it wasn't the point of the argument. The only thing I miss about Dota is playing <laughs> Marana and Spirit Breaker, and I'll oh. never have that experience again. But I'm all right with that, honestly. Oh, I hate this. What's Lin mm -hmm. saying? He could have a sex egg. Are you talking about me? Oh well, there you go. You have permission. You would to have know a sex if egg. I had a sex egg. Well, maybe she's saying it would in you? the in the UK way, which is like she's giving you permission to have it. Mm -hmm. Oh. Why would, someone, why would a sing of another care if you had a Wow! Sex? Yeah, I don't... That was oh such a good God. amazing arrow. <laughs> How did that, that, was that even That was Katniss happen? Everdeen, the girl on fire, just got you right there. <laughs> it fucking threaded the needle through that little hole. Damn straight. That was hot. That was amazing. Awesome, Thank I you, like it. Mix Master Mike for the 501 says, No shit, my brother used one of those disposable Tanga eggs for roughly two years. They're supposed, oh. to last, they're supposed to last for six uses max. That's... Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, six? Oh my god. Ew. Wait, so they're disposable, you... but like you can use them multiple times, I, I guess. I guess you'd like rinse it out in between them? You know, like a condom. <laughs> no, no, this cannot, this cannot happen. Get your brother wait. help. All I'm saying is, you know, the good lord gave us hands. And I think he sounds like the type of guy that would keep a cardboard box. Men, for his... yeah, that's the thing. Men can't be trusted with sex toys because that's. A, I agree. We yeah. already have like universal ones that work, and then you still hear about things. People are like, "Yeah, I just kind of like come on my belly and then wipe it up with my shirt and then fall asleep and wear the same clothes to school the next day." And you're like, "No, stop that." <laughs> Or the, the guy, oh, it was like nasty. the one guy who's like, I just come on my pillow and then cover it up with a pillowcase. And you're like, oh, oh what? <laughs> I, People I, are so fucking gross. It's, it's not, not that, that you know what I hate is that it's not that fucking hard to not make a mess. It really yeah. isn't. You take it's like not really one... really happening on Reddit right now. I mean, I guess that's like, like having a gel cover to your pillow. Oh. oh. <laughs> There's also a remarkable yeah. amount of stories and chat will, I'm sure, back this up. There's so many stories that come up on Reddit that are like, oh yeah, like when I was 11, I jerked it in class. And you're like, why? Yeah, that's <laughs> crazy. Don't do yeah. that. Just go that's home. A new generation. <laughs> well, I think you probably can't go home if you're 11. Dude, kids nowadays are just beating it in class, giving each other BJs in class. Like nobody has any respect. Yeah, for class or the for BJs. Class. Stop being gross, Aww. just eat your food. That's normal, right? <laughs> Honestly, like, if a dude was just, like, eating his semen instead of putting it in his pillow cover, that's I better. feel like that would be, that'd be a lot does. better, yeah. Do you that's, remember that's... that show they did on MTV? The, uh, the, was it Love Line or something like that, where they'd call mm, okay, in yeah. questions? And they had, uh, what was it? Was it Ben Stein? Dr. Drew Pinsky. No, oh, yeah. Dr. Drew, of course. I don't know why I thought it was yeah. Ben Stein. One guy called in and he's like, I just wanted to ask about like the nutritional benefits of eating your own semen. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I heard that it's really good for you. It has a lot of protein. And Dr. Drew was like, yeah, like it's it's not anything really that serious that you should be thinking about eating it. And he's like, <laughs> fuck, I've been eating it for like a year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even kidding, this really happened on this show. Well, one, I, I've told this story, I'm sure, but one of my housemates, we just found out one day, he, uh, otherwise, normal individual. But then yeah. it just came out that he, like, when he comes, he comes, like, in a glass. Oh! And then we were like, why? And he's like, well, so it doesn't use tissues. Like, I just do it in the glass, and then I go rinse it off in the bathroom. And I, oh, like, it, reuse it later. We uh, already oh! heard the story about the guy with the sink. If you value tissues that fucking much... Yes. <laughs> there's a problem. It was I mean... not mouth. <laughs> that you know of. It was, well, yeah. I guess if he's not drinking out of the glass, or I guess even if he is, I don't know. Not kink shaming or anything. Somebody sent me a 10,000 bit and it doesn't even say who it was. <laughs> Thank you, whoever that was. Someone <laughs> sent me 10 gallons of cum the other day, actually. Oh, so, nice. What'd you do so, with yeah. it? I drank it all. Yeah. Good. <laughs> good. Oh, yeah. so much protein. Good for so you. good for yeah. you. Mm -hmm. It is. Yeah, a lot of protein in it. Yeah. That's uh, that's why I'm going on a Soylent-only diet from now on. Mm. 
Actually, I was gonna make that a sub goal that if I reach a thousand subs again, I'm gonna try to only drink Soylent for three days and see if it kills me. That sounds okay, awful. It's obviously not going to kill you. <laughs> oh, it's well, Necros. I think. I think he the has real question is, badge now. is if that friend that you had used paper plates, then <laughs> there's a real issue there. He did not use paper plates. All right. <laughs> like. That and that should give you like some indication of where I anchor you guys at. That the dude who came in a glass was like still one level higher on the adulthood scale. <laughs> and to his credit, when we were like, "Why do you come in a glass?" He's like, "You know what? It doesn't really make a lot of sense. You guys have presented a case that's pretty, you know, it's it's ironclad. Seems a little ridiculous. I don't know if he stopped, but." Regardless, why well, stop? Yeah, keep coming. Why uh, Don't stop coming? Buy the cow and you can get the milk for free, right? Anyway, we're you gonna can. be back. Yeah, exactly. I heard that too. Play some Who Wants Just to Be a Millionaire. Just milk yourself. See you soon. <laughs> we made them all queasy. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, you gotta grow up. You know. Well, there's yeah. only one way to settle your stomach at this point. Drink some cum. Drink some cum. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's the only way. I'm glad Rob knew I was getting that there. Uh, absolutely, yeah. Pretty I awesome always things. know when you're getting that cum, buddy. Good old cum, cum buddy. buddy. <laughs> you gotta make sure you have your cum, buddy, you know? Yeah, no. It's Everyone important. needs their cum, buddy. Cum, buddy? Isn't that a... It's like a Korean thing, isn't cum it? Cum, buddy, to love. <laughs> oh, don't ruin that song. <laughs> we all need cum, buddy, to lean on. Cum, buddies. <laughs> Hey, oh, bear. It's Bear. It's Bear. Bear, hey. bear, what are you coming? Oh, are we starting this way today? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's genuine, like, not happiness in your voice. Yeah, <laughs> yeah there was. Well, You're my, like, hi, I'm happy answer. to be here. And then, oh, <laughs> it's one of those shows, huh? My the, wife. The first, yeah, exactly. The first thing yeah, I did. That's I what I was my wife. For. Yeah, yeah right. but you can't say that because it's like a little. You know, <laughs> it's a little too I mean, far. Is it a little risque? There's nothing it wrong is. with coming in your wife. I mean, yeah, you know, that's what she's saying. There's anything wrong with it? It's just like too personal. Uh, yeah. Are you, oh come on, like, <laughs> okay. What? If two people in a relationship are having sex? No way. No, that's not what yeah. I mean. Yeah, but to suggest that it's just an object to deposit fluid into. That's <laughs> not <laughs> more what I'm after there. <laughs> First, first thing, I'll answer the question. Is it open season on Millionaire? I'm just, um, I, why not, just dude? Sort of hopping in. Okay, yeah. cool, cool. Second thing, uh, when I was younger, I just, I would use tissues. That's, That's all I would do. Extremely right, sensible. Yeah. yeah. Wait, wait. Just, you, you said when I was younger. So what is it now, though? Tissues. Oh, all right. <laughs> Fair enough. All right. No, it seemed like a good strategy still, I mean, and even in my older years, it still persists. Yeah. Right. No, that's that's fair. Yeah. 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 I don't know why people coming in a box and stuff or coming in. So box, it's so you know, unnecessary. Like, coming in the yeah. gym. Yeah. <laughs> the coming box adult, actually the gym. makes no sense to me. I, I don't get it. Like, what's the point? Why? Why would you do that? I don't even get the sock either. No, that doesn't. No, none of it makes sense. Like got, unless you have no fucking money and you can't afford paper towels or tissues or toilet paper. Control Shift N cum box. Okay, let me find this. <laughs> no. You do that. Was, to you really want to see that picture again? But no, I just Why? want to read this story. Okay, yeah. it's a shoe box, or at least it was. Whenever I masturbate, I come into it. it was. I've had it. That's, basically, you're just going like, this is efficiency at its height. Is like, why would I use tissues every time I jerk off when I could just jerk off onto the same piece of garbage and then throw that away in 10 years? Um, okay. I've had it for two or three years now, I think, so it has a fair amount of cum. It smells atrocious, and I tried to burn it once. When I lit it on fire, it was too damp due to the cum that it simply sizzled and didn't manage to actually light up. Oh, Turns out it's... I tried to burn it? Turns Wish out... I had a warning on this stream today, dude. I didn't know you were going to be reading this out loud. Turns out burning cum smells awful, so I had to spray it with a deodorant body spray just to get the old smell of burnt cum away. It also has some drenched papers stuck to it. That's pretty much it. Ah! Apparently, ah. 
A lot of people are asking me why. Well, I'm a disturbed individual, but it just kind of <laughs> happened. Bought new shoes and needed some place to come, used the box. It just escalated from there, kept using it each time, telling myself that I would throw it out soon. Never did. <laughs> Two or three years later, I still have it. It wasn't planned or anything, it just happened. Yeah. I often it get just PM'd. happened. I Reddit often story. get PM'd about updates or current status of the box. Generally a few a week. So I might as well update this post. If anyone gets linked here anymore, current status, I have created life. Mold has begun to grow in the box and has taken oh! over a fair amount. Smells ah! a bit worse, mainly due to a damper apartment so it does not dry as fast. I, I will... I will never be rid of my need for it. I hate and love this box just as I hate and love myself. Run! Don't look at the Hold picture. On. Don't do not look at the picture. You do not want to see that. But also, due to a damper apartment, meaning he moved and took the box took it with, with him. him. That's a good point. That's a good point. I didn't even think of that. What? The or what? maybe the biome shifted around him. I never thought about that. He oh, took it with him. God. Wait, what? I just got back. He took it oh, with him. He moved moving truck. to another apartment and Why? took it. He had no. What if he got a moving service to do it? They had to ask the question. Oh. What is this box? Do you think he just <laughs> rode fragile on the side? <laughs> <laughs> Contains human life. <laughs> oh my God. And, and are paper plates so bad now, chat? Now that you know. Well, it does get man. worse. I mean, I guess you could use the same paper plate for every meal for two years. And, but I don't. And then move and take that same paper plate with you and keep eating off of it. And then come on it and keep eating off of it again. These people in chat asking for a link. Ryan went through the process of finding it within 0.5 seconds before yeah. he started talking about it. Yeah. You can do it too. Just yeah. Google Cumbox. And also you shouldn't share that link on our Twitch pages. Yeah. I mean, for all yeah. the stuff we talk about, by all means. <laughs> Actually, yeah, you know, Crime gives a good way to do it. Just Google Cumbox in Incognito. Yes. Yeah, Control definitely shit do down. it in yeah. Control yeah, shit you, you don't want that in your browser history. Chad, you, you can read the story, you babies. <laughs> right? <laughs> I know it's gross, but you can read the story. <laughs> <laughs> he said yeah, something you gross. Yeah, you you, you want to know what gross saying May is the one about the dude his mom jerked him off for yeah. years and his arms. Okay, how about we start up the game now? Oh, I'm, yeah, we're already, we lost fastest fingers, so now we're on the hot seat. Okay. On what device is a system called Windows most likely to be used? All right, let's just skip that one. That's the correct answer. You know, and then there's oh, also the one the of the guy OS. who made the cum syrup for the rich guy. Yeah. That's another bad one. Problem so far. That's quality. Quality. He, he got it stolen and then they like held it blackmail. But what his cum syrup? Yeah. Really? I guess it was very valuable or something, so they, they wanted it back, so they Too offered far. a bunch of money. You know, you said let's stop and now you're going. No, I'm sorry, go ahead, go ahead. What was the Please preferred stop. method of execution during the French French Revolution? Oh no, not this! The Friends one. <laughs> the <laughs> Friends Revolution. <laughs> no one told you death was gonna be this way. Gilla guillotine. Gilla guillotine. Why come up so often? <laughs> In which Disney film is the unbirthday song sung at a tea party? Unbirthday. Unbirthday? That's Alice, Alice fall back one, into the it? womb? It's Alice in Wonderland. That's an Alice in Gotta Wonderland. Gotta be Alice. Oh, I've never... I didn't know that. This is the last Do you know what country Kylie Minogue's from? At all. Australia. Yep, that's correct. Uh, yeah. What fictional place is the setting for the musical Wicked? Kansas. Actually, uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's Kansas. Yeah, fictional. it's definitely... <laughs> <in the middle. laughs> All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay. We got the first five questions down. I'm ready. I gotta wait for the presentation. Here we go. What color describes ranges of mountains in New South Wales, Jamaica, and Oregon, USA? Gray mountains, red mountains, blue mountains, yellow mountains. Jamaica and Oregon? It's blue. Hmm. 
Mm. It's blue. Oh, do you know that? Yeah. Nice. Blue Mountains in Oregon, but then also Blue Mountain Coffee is a. So like a what's that? Protected. Well, no, it's a it's a Jamaican coffee, but it's like a heritage food, so it has to fit like the standards and be produced in whatever region. And anyway. Mm. Sean Connery's character in Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade is Professor Hector Jones, Henry Jones, Hamish <laughs> Jones, or oh, Hamish. Hubert Jones. Hamish Hamlo for Jones. sure. It's a Sean Connery name. But <laughs> it's... It, it's Henry, though. It's Henry, yeah, it's Henry Jones. Jones. Okay. But okay, it's gotta right. be Hamish, but it is Henry Jones. <laughs> it should be Hamish. That would be way yeah. cooler. Yeah. Henry That's Jones is correct. Yeah. yeah. What a I bad name. More fucking... Indiana Jones. Yeah, me too. We great should do movies. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's great movies. You need to watch Indiana Jones. Jones. Oh my god, you guys. You, you're killing me, actually. Dun, dun, like, I'm dying. Dun. This is what I... There's infinite media. And, like, I'm almost done, or almost caught up, at least, with Game of Thrones. You with just tell me to watch oh, more no, shit. No, no. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, I mean, you've already watched Breaking Bad and Black Mirror, so, like, I'm, I'm yeah. set. Pretty much for you. You still need to do One Punch Man, though. Stop. Um, yep. yeah, yeah. Paramaribo is the capital of which South American country? Suriname, Ryan. Paraguay, French Guiana, or Bolivia? I this think is it's. I think it's Suriname. You've still got. What do you mean? You think? Well, this is not like what's the cap. Brasilia is the capital of which South American well, country? No, That's easy enough. What the fuck is Suriname? You're getting. What is Brasilia? It's the capital of Brazil. That makes what sense, yeah. Call it Brazil again. <laughs> yeah, but you're one to talk capital of the United States is called Washington, comma, D period, C period. Yeah, you're right. That's pretty stupid. <laughs> what relation is the fat? It was Suriname. What nice. relation is the fashion designer Paloma Picasso to the artist Pablo Picasso? Granddaughter, niece, daughter, sister. I thought granddaughter? When did Pablo Picasso die? Like 1970? 1960? Was it that late? Dang. Yeah, I, I thought he was a much earlier. I thought it was like artist. early 1900s, but I, I don't know. Yeah. I feel like Pablo. <laughs> <laughs> Pablo only Picasso. mode. That's very Gonzalo of you. Letonga. Gonzalo means Dan Giesling, right? I'm sorry, Dan Giesling. Yeah. 1973. Hell yeah. Wow. So if he died in 1973, let's say he was mm -hmm. 80, that would mean that he was born in 1893. So his daughter would be fucking ancient. Yeah. yeah. His granddaughter so, would be like in her 40s, maybe. But how yeah. old is Paloma Picasso? I mean, we don't know. Thing, right. Yeah. Or actually, his granddaughter yeah. would be in like her 60s. Well, it's not his yeah. sister, so we can eliminate Let's rule that. out D. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think... <laughs> I think they're implying that wait, 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 wait. Picasso is a person that still exists. What if Pablo Picasso's parents had him when they were like 16 and then had his sister when they were like 70? My Ooh. God. You've that broken it wide open. All right, you know nearly what? Nearly biologically impossible. <laughs> I'm asking the audience. Yeah, do it. Audience. I want to I want to say it's daughter. It might be. I, I still think it's granddaughter, personally, but, well, you know, it's just an educated guess. Yeah. Yeah, I'm more on the granddaughter train, but that might be a red herring. Ooh, granddaughter got 12%. Oh. And daughter got 33, yeah. so. You never right. get on the granddaughter train. Never no. leads anywhere good. Yeah. It never is his daughter. granddaughter. Oh, wow. Nice. Also if he had a kid in like fucking 1920, they would be 97 years old now. Yeah. Like, get over it. I'm glad we're not 97 <laughs> years old yet. Yes. We have a lot of years left to live. All right, we got it. We got it. Right. By what Americ? By what name was the American singer and songwriter Giles Perry Richardson Jr. commonly known? Oh. Buddy Holly, Little Richard, Big Bopper, or Richie Valens? <laughs> Big Little Bopper. Richard. But Little Richard is still alive? Oh, it was, yeah. it's a was instead of an is. Okay. Uh, is it fucked up to say, but like after 2016, I honestly don't know what celebrities are alive anymore. 
Yeah. yeah. It's a, well, this game was also made in like 2012 or something. Oh, <laughs> right? uh, so. yeah, that's true. I think it's... so. They were dead in 2012. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, everybody! It's Little Richard and Big Bopper in the morning coming at you live. <laughs> it's traffic time. Did you think, think it was Little Bopper. Richard just because his last name is Richard's son? It's yeah, like. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a junior, so it's Richardson, yeah. Richardson Jr., Richard little Richard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it makes sense. I, I mean, mean, it does actually make sense from a naming scheme. Does anybody... Giles Perry Richardson Jr.? No. No. <laughs> Giles? <laughs> what if it's Buddy Giles. Holly? I mean, yeah, Giles if, is the name of that... Uh, Giles. The, the dude... Sonic Boom! <laughs> the dude from, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, The Thing. All right, I'm gonna go 50-50 and hope that they leave Little Richard up there. Computer, take away two wrong answers <laughs> and leave the right answer. It's gonna be Little Richard and Big Bopper. Oh, Big Bopper it is money. Little Richard and Big Bopper. Yeah, oh. Big Bopper out. Yeah, it's gotta yeah. be Big Bopper. Genius. Yeah. Big Who the fuck is Big Bopper? He goes, "Hello, baby." <laughs> To blow them up and put your hands inside and get ready to have <laughs> the time of your life. Oh yeah, Big you Bopper. Go right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, not the, not the second one, but the first one. It was Big Bopper. It was that Big old Bopper. rockabilly look. My God. I never rocked a Billy goat. Why not? You can't lose money. Oh, man, right. he, he died when he was 29. It's fucked up, dude. In Damn, the Harry Bopper. Potter books, what is the name of Hermione's cat? Hermione. Sc Scabbers, <laughs> Mouser, Crookshanks, or Mrs. Crookshanks. Norris? Chris, Chris. Yes. Nice. I knew I could rely on you guys for that one. Yo, okay. hold up, hold up Harry a second. Potter nerds. That last yeah. question was was were Richie Valens and Buddy Holly oh, two of the other options? Yes. Yeah. The day the music died, yes. February third, nineteen fifty nine. They all died in a plane mm. crash. They all died in a plane crash. And then the Big song Hammer. American Pie was written about that. It's a huge. Mm -hmm. I just money. learned that. Yeah. All right. Post it on TIL. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> In what year did both the Wall Street crash and the St. Valentine's Day massacre occur? 1924, oh. 1927, 1929, or 1931? It'd have to be 1927, right? 29? It was late 20s, but I don't know which one of those. Let's see what they come up with. I think it was 27 to 36. I'm phoning my boy Christian Bale. Mm hmm. Okay. Ooh. Uh, Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, is that you, Christian? Uh, <laughs> Christian, can you hear us? Yeah, Christian. <laughs> Are you there, Christian? <laughs> we need your help, Christian. <laughs> we have a question for you. <sighs> he just sighed and gave us a dash. <laughs> wow. Miwaniwanga <laughs> solo. Damn it, Christian Bale. I don't know. We got four answers and four I people. It's either 27 or 29. It's 29. You think it's 29? It's 29, 100%. It's 29. I could be comfortable with 29. I, well, it's good. I clicked on it. You know how we knew? Uh, it's correct. Because yeah, Big Bopper yeah. died when he was 29. Yeah. Oh, it all ties together. Follow and the money. And the other answer was C as well. Oh, it's all coming And his last name was Richardson, so it all worked out. Ah. What two European capital cities stand less than 37 miles apart? Hell yes. Okay. <laughs> we got um, Sofia and Skopje. So that's Macedonia and Bulgaria. I don't you know. know where that is? Yeah, I mean... Belgrade and Budapest is uh, Serbia and Hungary. And then yeah. Vienna and Bratislava is Austria and Slovakia. Bratislava, Bratislava. Actually, go to my house in town. And then you threw an H at the end of Budapest. Budapest. Yeah. Budapest. Budapest. And then uh, Zagreb hey, and Ljubljana is uh, Croatia and Slovenia. So I don't I know. I think it's C, probably. It's tough, dude. It's tough because. Oof. All of these countries are pretty close together. Yeah. But I'm like I'm almost thinking D, Zagreb and Ljubljana because yeah. like Lub Ljubljana is in Slovenia and Slovenia is so small. It's like a little infant country. Uh-huh. 
that yeah. gave us the first lady of the United States. And <laughs> it's like Croatia, though, but I don't know. Is Zagreb in the north of Croatia? I think I'm going D. Fuck all y'all. Wow. We're not going to fight you. You're probably right. It's either D or C. He's wrong! Is it C? Dude, I'm surprised you're wrong on that. Obviously. It was indeed C. Vienna and yeah. Bratislava. Oh, no. I mean, picking C. Czechoslovakia is like right, you know, Did nestled you, next Are to you a hundred years old? <laughs> well, oh, okay, Czechoslovakia yeah, I, I and the Austro Hungarian Empire. Uh. <laughs> All right. Yes, I know. But remember, most of my geography is from EU4, so, you know. Give me a break here. Give me a break, man. Breaker, breaker. I also, Czech Czechoslovakia, you know, went away in like 1944. Actually, it went away in like 1994. Oh, yeah. I mean, it did right. go away in 19. Yeah. 38 for a little while, but yeah, it came back. That's true. Well, <laughs> the one thing to remember is that I was right. <laughs> <laughs> That's the, the one thing we should all take away from this. Put these authors in the order they won the Nobel Prize for Literature. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, that should be easy. Mm -hmm. Definitely like, start with that guy, and then you got like... There you go. Well, let's see the result. Sick. Sick. <clears throat> oh, well. Oh, they give me fucked it up pretty bad. Got one of them, though. Rudyard Kipling. He wrote the Jungle Book. Mmm. Do you get, like, extra dollars for this? Nah. I don't even know why they have you do it, honestly. <laughs> it's just for simulatory reasons. Like, I'm already Maybe? sitting in the chair when I do it. So it's not like they're going to kick me out. <laughs> well, I mean, United Airlines has a different... Oh! Oh! Current events. What is that sound effect, Austin? I like that. Can I get that on the soundboard? <laughs> That's what you hear. It's the last thing you hear if you're flying United Airlines. <laughs> Oh, bum, bum, bum. Did you guys see that thing with the uh the like some like newscaster for CNN or something? Yes. Was like, it, <laughs> he, he says like he, he makes a tweet seriously Delta and it's a picture of the the seat next to him of this adorable dog in a bow tie and he's mad <laughs> for sitting Why? next to this adorable. Dog. I don't know, but he he got he's you know people were pretty angry at him. <laughs> I actually did see that, but I didn't understand the context, and I didn't care enough to look it up. That's the oh, it's process. pretty good. That's some good stuff, man. Why was he mad? I don't know. It was like the cutest like... picture of a doggo with a bow tie and everything. And he's like, seriously, Delta? You're going to make my plane ride a hundred times better? Come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Next, I'm going to get a free Hershey's bar when I fucking take yeah, off. Yeah, yeah. What do you think? Awful. People in chat are like, I don't want to sit next to a damn dog. Have you ever sat next to a person on an airplane? It's awful. Yeah, yeah, I would much true. rather sit That's next to a dog. Yeah, yeah give it to me one of your bow tie. <laughs> Wait, take a cat. On any oh, human versus any dog. The context is they separated the owner from the dog. No, see, the thing is, that's what he said. Uh, because he said that after everyone was really pissed at him, and he sent another tweet, which is, like, really weirdly worded. Um, and you see in the first picture, there's, like, a person's legs right next to the dog. And the dog's <laughs> sitting in between a person's legs. They separated the dog from the Just tell me who to be mad at! <laughs> who to be mad at, God? <laughs> okay. Which of these men invented an electronic taping system for reducing hiss on tape recordings? Rick Derby, Roger Danby, Roy Digby, or Ray Dolby? <laughs> really good names for you to read. Rick Derby, Roger Danby, Roy Digby, or Ray Dolby? It was Ray Dolby. Because, you know, Dolby, Dolby Digital. You clearly do right. Oh, I didn't even put that question. together. That makes a lot of sense. How many slots are there on a standard American roulette wheel? 36, 37, 38, 39. Oh, you got uh, Juicy 30. Slots. Ooh, what's the what's the odds? Isn't it 37 to 1? Roulette wheel, there's 32 plus two zeros, right? So 34. 
That's not even up there, man. That's not even <laughs> an option, man. What the fuck? I think it's 37. No, dude, there's two <laughs> zeros. Is there two zeros? There's, there's a, a zero, zero and a double zero. 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 I, oh, I didn't know that was... Is that standard or is that just like certain boards? Juicy slots. I have no idea. It was 38. That's the right okay. answer. Did we lose? That's fine. Yeah. Hell I posted the uh, 38? Uh, 38. chat, but God, it's no problem. It's, good. it's a good picture of a dog. Six plus two. Okay. I thought I went up to 32. Life. Take your time. I'll post it in Discord, too. Here. That's the doggo. Which of these South American countries does not have a Pacific coastline? Colombia? Ecuador? Peru? <laughs> or Venezuela? <laughs> Yeah, I almost but... didn't catch that. <laughs> the only way to say the name of that country is by eliminating all of the consonants. Romeo? <laughs> Romeo? That's what whenever we say the island in Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. The we're island. Like, yeah, we're like, hey, do you guys want to land at the island? <laughs> You've still got a friend. Sorry, exactly. Yeah. yeah, all right. See? <laughs> <laughs> I actually don't know oh. this one, by the way. I think uh, it might be Venezuela, because in Rainbow Six Three, the first level takes place in Caracas, and they fly you on a map to Caracas, and it's like right in the like Atlantic Ocean area. It's in like the northeast coast of South America. You know what? Caracas. Caracas. I think it's Colombia. 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 That's the Colombia. So it is Venezuela. Well All right. Sick. Colombia de caffeinated coffee crystals. So you're saying it's not an island, man. <laughs> it is not Bolegda. the island. Take your time on this one. <laughs> oh man. Eh Colombia? <laughs> Colombia. <laughs> Who composed Spots. the opera Carmen? George Bizet? Claude Debussy? Maurice Ravel? Or Giuseppe Verdi? Giuseppe! It's Giuseppe. But is it actually? I actually Giuseppe don't know. Verdi. I, I thought, want it to be Giuseppe because it's got the best name. It's Bizet. 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 George Bizet. Bizet. I have no idea. I'm just going to pick it. Yeah, yeah do it. The dog is so happy. I just saw the tweet. Right? He's the happiest little dog. How can you be mad? <laughs> He's mad at the dog. <laughs> oh, fuck this stupid fucking dog. He's <laughs> so happy, so much happier than I am. <laughs> God, what a fucking asshole. Take your time. You get it right? Yeah. And then look yes. at his other tweet about it. After he gets all the hate. This dog is cute and oh, service. Fuck. Companion and emotional support dog <laughs> equals best souls on earth. Point was. <laughs> <laughs> the tweet is made by a dog. Yeah, it was. The dog beat his ass, took his yeah. phone, and is tweeting from his account. Are you yeah. Right? Exactly. Let's see I don't trust that know. man is all I'm saying, man. <laughs> by what name? Is the nation formerly called the Ellis Islands now known? Tuvalu, Kiribati, Fiji, or Letonge? Letonge! Letourno! Letourno. How'd you, how'd you paper cut yourself? Hey, Kate! Hey, Kate! Uh, hey, Kate! She's playing Heroes of the Swarm. <laughs> Heroes of the Swarm! Heroes of the Swarm! I'm just going with Tuvalu because it Tuvalu. won the... It won the the answer nice. from the audience. That's this is a smart right. audience here. Yeah. Hey, they all have their it must be out. Letonge. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't there, there's an Ellis <laughs> Islands and an Ellis Islands? Yeah, Ellis this Island. is like... Oh, Ellis Island. <laughs> Ellis Island yeah. is where the <laughs> climax of the first X-Men movie takes place. Right, mm -hmm. that's true, yeah. Yeah, I know. I've been there. It was all right. What, what'd you prefer I was in, yellow spandex? That's, that's, that was a great Hugh Jackman. Was that Logan? Yeah, that was. <laughs> that was Logan. 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 <laughs> uh, so Argos, Argos Stoli is the capital of which Greek island? Cephalonia. What is with these geography ones. <laughs> yeah, yeah, really. Seriously. Corfu or Kos. I have no I, idea. No, I, I have no you. idea. All right, so we're going to just like Stephanie. phone. I'm going to phone yeah. my friend who loves Greece. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, mm -hmm. 
Uh, <laughs> hey, <laughs> Achilles, <laughs> what's up, buddy? Oh, uh, yeah, that's. I'd buy some armored shoes if I were you. Uh, oh, yeah. Hey, by the <laughs> way, like, all right, he says it's Cephalonia. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, go for it, man. I have no fucking idea. What so. are armored shoes? Well, you know what? It's... Well done. That's the right no, go ahead. Black high top trainers, you know? Well played. <laughs> I know what oh, Corfu yeah. is. It's gotta be Not Cephalonia. It, it was Cephalonia. Yeah. Thanks, yeah. Thanks Achilles. It's a pretty cool name for a place. place. Well, dude, of course, it's it's in Greece. This is gonna have yeah. a badass name. Which Cephalonia. explorer was the first to lead an expedition across the Pacific Ocean? John Cabot, Christopher Columbus, da Gama. Ferdinand Magellan, or Vasco da Gama? Da Gama. Magellan. It's da Gama. It's, the, it's it? da Gama. I think um, so. I clicked it. So you in for a penny? You're in for a fucking pound. <laughs> <laughs> this is incorrect. No! You said it He's so. Not? You said it even before the answers had popped up. Right on, Pacific Ocean, right? This is Ferdinand Magellan, apparently. It's Magellan. What did Dagama do? Hold the on. Gama! <laughs> the Gama! The Gama! The Gama! The Gama! First, you, oh, first European to reach India by sea. Mm. So he went. Where did, where did he go? Oh, you know, he just took uh, a dog sled all the way through Russia. Then took yeah. his boat off from the Pacific Ocean, and then he decided to sail all the way around the European continent, and then just come down they to India that way. around Africa. The Gama. Mm. Well, the fuck, Gama. man. The Gama. I was talking about Gama. I'm not gonna answer anymore. I'm sorry. No, it's the Gama. <laughs> He's way older than Picasso. I mean, I don't know anything about exploration or explorers. Yeah. Ferdinand Magellan was the first dude to circumnavigate, circumnavigate the globe. And yeah. then okay. Christopher mm -hmm. Columbus like landed America. in America yeah. and like started the colonization of it. Yeah, but the Vikings created Vinland. We in Newfoundland and Labrador. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Vinland. Uh, Vinland. Ooh, who's who's older here? I don't know. That's a tough one. Oh, in the order they were born. No, this is fine. This is fine. All right. Well, let's see the result. He's done it. Yeah, that's a good bear gif. I want one. Yeah. He's the first to circumcise the globe. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody has to do it. That's true. It's a tough job. I thought it would be a moil, but you never know. <laughs> That's just such a great name for a thing. Yeah. A moil. I don't know. I just like saying that word, moil. I heard they're trying to pass legislation to stop the moils from sucking on baby dicks. Yeah. <laughs> God, it's about time. Right. Yeah, jeez. Well, because they keep giving people, like, herpes, and that's not right. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty weird. Best of luck. I'm not gonna villainize all moils, but <laughs> no, but it's a real thing. I mean, you're saying that in Judaism that there is a ritual Judah! where they suck the blood off with wine. Judah! That's and super they, not Gonzalez. They put their mouth on the cut <laughs> on the baby's penis, which is fucking yeah. weird. I mean, I'm not yeah. gonna disagree with you on that one. That's the right I don't know how to respond to anything that involves the words baby penis. Like, yeah. I feel like I just have to abstain from that conversation by default. <laughs> you know what, really That's fair, the yeah. most reasonable answer anyone's had all day. Mm -hmm. yeah. Just yeah. Don't even respond to any of that. <laughs> I don't think there's an out for you at that. Yeah, like, if isn't. you decide to go in in that conversation, you've got to make a choice. Yeah. You might as well take it. Hashtag not my moil. It's a real thing, though. In the Boils. TV comedy series Friends, which character is played by Jennifer Aniston? Ruby TV Black, comedy. Ruby Black, Rachel Green, Rona Gray, or Rebecca Brown? <laughs> Rebecca <laughs> Brown. Well, we all know it's Rona Gray, obviously, so you oh, might yeah. as well just click that, yeah. This is the, last point the answer is Ruby Black. <laughs> what kind of name is Rona? It's the name of know, our kind of version cool of name. Lowe's. Which of these cities is Rona? sometimes regarded as the birthplace of the Renaissance? Italy? Rona. Which of these cities, Nick? <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Rona. 
Which uh, which cities are they? It's Florence. Oh, okay. You already got. It. There was only one answer, and it was Florence. All yeah. you had to do was click it. <laughs> <laughs> That's who wants to be a millennial millionaire. <laughs> Hello. I don't yeah, want to click the answer. Right. Why do I have to choose? Just make it easy. <laughs> Poison sauce is used in the traditional cuisine of what country? Japan, Vietnam, China, or Sweden? Japan. No. Poison? 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 No, that's China, right? Correct. Let's okay. Well, it's the right answer. But we don't. Poison's delicious, though. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, I'm bored, like, most of the time. Yeah. It's terrible. Yeah, what? <laughs> You're anti <laughs> the poison? <laughs> <laughs> For which Olympics did the Olympic torch first travel by air? 1908 London, 1924 Paris, 1956 Melbourne, or 1960 Rome? I have no idea. Hear me out here. Mm. You might think 1924, near the birth of aviation, right? I would think no. that, yeah. But Too I'm early. thinking 1956 Melbourne, because... Right. They're gonna put it's that so Olympic torch. Far. They're gonna put that shit on a boat and sail it for a million years. Yeah, yeah. he's right. I'm Plus, with you on that. Let's go. You gotta think like. Plus, they probably sea. gave it at least three decades before they brought any sort of fire on board That's air right. travel devices. <laughs> right? <laughs> they wanted to make sure that everything was gonna be on the up and up. It was C. We did it. It's always C. It's good Just reason. Start picking C for all the, for the rest of the time. It's all C. Even save yeah, our lifeline. Yeah, just choose C. All right. Yeah. Let's. I mean, that was that was like Rona Gray or whatever. But sure. <laughs> <laughs> I which am. Was obviously the answer. I am. Sasha Fierce is a 2008 album by which singer? Duffy, Beyonce, Madonna, or Dido? Uh, I think it's Beyonce. I mean, it is, but it's not C. So we're coming up to a, an oh, impasse here because, like, yeah, Beyonce rough. is right. But yeah, Madonna right, no. is C. Mm, what about Madonna? Makes it right. <laughs> mm, good point. Good point. Yeah, Why I didn't Madonna get a Madrina sponsorship? I know. Mm. That's the oh, you know what though? Also, D Illuminati. So we should pick D. Mm. Oh, yeah. We got a lot of different points to consider. I mean, I just picked the right answer though. So like, uh, it's it's, Beyonce. I mean, we know it's Beyonce. So that's reasonable, you honestly. Time. Picking the right one. Have a good look. What is the I capital city it, of Albania? Um, God. I believe that that would have to be Tirana. Sarajevo oh, is Bosnia. Reykjavik is Iceland. And Skopje oh, is Macedonia. Yeah. So it's got to oh, be yeah. Tirana. Pirana. Madrinas. Madonna. Beyonce. Sasha. We did it. Tirana. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? what? Is that a song you just made up? <laughs> We did it. Garages, hey. but I'm not come on, pretty mama. <laughs> would you guys eat piranha? Hell yeah, I would. Yeah, I mean, I guess so. It would be a you great added, act of defiance for yes, humankind. Yes. You added mm -hmm. stew at the end, like, <laughs> like oh, I'm going to get him. Would you eat piranha? Stew. <laughs> exactly. Well, which city is the capital of the German state of North Rhine-Westphalia? Jesus Christ. Did you pick Geography Edition? Essen, yeah, like, what's happening? Dusseldorf, Dortmund, Cologne. Cologne! 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 I feel like it's um, Dusseldorf. Austin, that was an Italian person. <laughs> yeah. This well, is a I mean, German city. You would think Northwest, Are right? Sure? I would imagine. Okay. Or is Westphalia the west of Germany? Uh, not, it's kind of the north of Germany. Was well, in North I'll Rhine, show you West my Westphalia. Oh, Hi, yo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think it's Cologne, actually. Cologne! Cologne! Uh, Cologne. Chat, or not chat, but ask the audience, says it's Dusseldorf. All right. Maybe I'm wrong. I say maybe. it's Hasselhoff. <laughs> <laughs> He laughed, so we're right. Or he's an asshole. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, we're right. <laughs> you say Dusseldorf, I say Hasselhoff, you know. <laughs> Dusseldorf? Would you guys like to taste my Dusseldorf? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it talks so silly in other parts of the world that are not where we live. Yeah, right? fuck them, am I right? <laughs> Why are they all so weird? We should just nuke them all.
Whoa. Hello. <laughs> I am an environmental engineer from Germany. <laughs> My IQ is 190 points. <laughs> That sounds a little like potion seller to me, but he can't be. You can't handle my strongest equations. <laughs> because they are written in German. According to Greek mythology, Daedalus made wings to escape from which island? Paxos, uh, Sicily, Crete, or Malta? Hold on. Crete. Can, you, can you go back a second? Who? Daedalus. 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 Daedalus, Texas. What is his name? Daedalus? Yeah, You're not Greek. Icarus and Daedalus. It's Crete, right? Yeah, right, probably. I'll, I'll pick it, whatever. <laughs> yeah, hey, if... probably. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's a Greek island that I know, so yeah. Daedalus. Daedalus. He talks so weird there. What's the most? Uh, what's yeah, the most? Popular? We should nuke him, right? <laughs> I don't like this. What's the most popular football team in Greece? Ooh, I know this. It's Thessaloniki FC. You have to play this. Wow. What? Mm. what? I was just gonna. I was just gonna say the De Dallas Cowboys. Oh, that's way better. <laughs> which Tur <laughs> no. Which Turkish resort? Oh no, that's right. It's Olympiakos. It's Olympiakos, uh, but it's actually Olympiakos, though. Oh, Which Turkish resort is built on the site of the ancient city of Halicarnassus? Izmir. Yeah, take the geography edition. Yeah. Dalian, Bodrum, or Kusadasi. Ah. Uh... <laughs> I'm gonna call I mean, my friend the uh, Emperor Justinian from the Byzantine Empire and say, right, hey, yeah. dude, hey, how's it going, you know, uniting the two thrones? Not so well, huh? Because of the whole Visigoth thing. Yeah, like, man, if you could, like, look into the future and tell me what they build on Halicarnassus, Your that'd be. Oh, he gave me a dash. He didn't even wait for 20 seconds. He just. Wow. <laughs> What the fuck? Are you sure you computer please? I don't know. If I had to make an educated guess, I'd say an ancient city in Turkey would be more towards the towards the west. So that doesn't really help. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I use 50/50 and we got C and D left. So let's be logical here. Turkish has seven letters in it. Bodrum okay. only has six. Now, Kusadasi has well, eight. So if we <laughs> want to go with the one no. with more letters... I chose... I stuck to first principles. When in doubt, go with C. Yeah. Yeah. And it was right. My Good. C? C the C? <laughs> It's a huge it works on Scantron tests also, if I remember. Mm -hmm. you clearly do not have to play As hey. of November 2009, what is the name of the world's fastest computer built by Cray? Ferrari, Lotus, by Jaguar, Cray. or Maserati? I, I mean, no I'm, you know what? It just... I just clicked on C, so good. C <laughs> dot! It's right! <laughs> <laughs> Easy fucking rares, boys. I thought it was like 60 PS3s chained together. <laughs> yeah. Uh, by the way, Halicarnassus, Halic, whatever. Mm -hmm. You know what? It's in the <laughs> west. It's in the west part of right? Turkey. Yeah. Have a good look. Which of the seven wonders of the ancient world is to be rebuilt? Temple of well, Artemis, Colossus. Statue of Zeus, Colossus of Rhodes, or Pharos of Alexandria? Colossus, Meaning, right? I mean, the they're Colossus rebuilding it? is C as well. So. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I are they the rebuilding Colossus. the Colossus? All right. So. Fuck it. That's pretty cool. It's right. Yeah. Oh. It's always C. It's always C. C is a magic letter. Thank you. I'm happy I, I actually you. knew that. We only have one more question to win a million dollars. It better be C. Is the answer. I mean, it is going to be C. Yeah. It can also be the word C S E A. That's also Oh fuck. <laughs> The Mendocino, Murray, and Molokai are three fra fracture zones in the bed of which ocean? Atlantic, yep. Indian, Arctic, or Pacific? 
Oh, god damn it. Oh, that's gotta be like Pacific, right? But it's D. Yeah, I know. Okay, I clicked it to avoid the appearance of impropriety. Yeah. <laughs> just... It's Pacific! Whoa! Yeah! Yeah! Well we're done. millionaires we, now. I mean, we did it. We saw the name Mendocino, and we're like, that's not the Arctic Ocean, let's be honest. Right. Yeah. Wow. Look at his, it. like, trivial golf clap. <laughs> A million dollars. Oh, whatever. Uh, fairly impressive, I suppose, given the size of my estate. <laughs> not quite, not quite the magnitude, so, but this will do. We'll split the million five ways, and I guess this will be our last stream, because we're all yeah. going to go buy yeah. mansions now. No, we don't need to be streaming <laughs> with, with $200,000. Yeah, we're, we're yeah. set for life. Yeah, After like taxes, a... like 120000 each, yeah. We're, we're if we're fine. lucky, it's it's probably under hundred. dollars <laughs> wow. house in the middle of Kansas. Well, we'll be back to play some yeah. uh, Long Dawn 2012. See you soon. Long Dawn. It's kind of depressing to think how yeah. quickly all that money goes away after it's you... It's gone! <laughs> well, yeah. we just like, earned it. It's it. <laughs> Usually, it's not split five ways on the show. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. They don't let you take a team up there? <laughs> like, if you guys want to give up your cut, we can make it stretch a little longer. All right, I'll do it. Nice. Are you pitching Are you an investment here? Shot. No, I'm Are just going to take the money. Uh... Oh, shit. <laughs> Are you just going to get, like, a big mansion streamer house? Because that sounds kind of cool. No. Did you guys know that... So there's this guy. You won the 2006 World Series of Poker. His name's Jamie Gold. Okay. That's and that, a good name. Great name <laughs> for a professional a gambler, game. right? And then, Dude, uh, you think that's good. The 2009 winner, his name is Chris Moneymaker. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Wait, are you serious? Or are you joking? I'm serious. Look yeah. it up. Yeah, yeah, that's so good. <laughs> but Jamie Gold... He won as a $12 million top prize, right? He had a deal with a company, and the, like the entry fee is like 10 grand or something like that, right? So he had a deal with a the company. They're like, we'll pay for your entry fee, but if you win, we get half. And then he oh. won, Whoa. and they oh, were like, boy. we'll take our $6 million now. And he was just like, nah. Oh. Like, <laughs> oh. like, he didn't have a contract? I, well, they went to court over it for like oh. four years, and eventually they settled out of court. But I was like, man, you took like a yeah. 1,000 to 1 shot and <laughs> lost and then, or I guess won, and then you're just going to cut him out. That's incredible. <laughs> balls on this guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, the 2000... You could, you could wreck a skyscraper with his balls. <laughs> the 2011 winner was um, uh, Roger, I'm going to win the World Series of Poker. I remember that guy, yeah. yeah. Very strong name for what he does. Yeah, it worked out for him, so. Whatever happened Good. to Greg Raymer, the, the lizard man with the, the goggles? Didn't have enough, na good name. Good like, enough name. go go put Chris Raymer, or sorry, Greg Raymer, not Jim Raymer. Greg Raymer into Google, and go look, at, I guarantee top picture is of him with those lizard goggles on. <laughs> go do it. Are you the one that had yeah. the lizard goggles, if I remember correctly? When I was swimming, yeah. All right. Yeah. Jo join up, join up, join up. Okay. Okay. I gotta find London. London 2012. We can do it earlier. I was, it was in a Hearthstone game. I just got surprised. The earlier? The earlier. <laughs> yeah, I was playing uh, Super Hexagon. I set two small records, but I didn't win anything new. Rip. Keep playing until you win. It's a great achievement. I know. I got all but one of the modes unlocked, so it's like oh, I've got dude. some time in the game. I just haven't conquered it yet. You got. What's Terry Cavanaugh doing these days? Not making Super Hexcon Two, which is a little bullshit, if you ask me. Mm. What did you call him? Terry Cavanaugh. Oh yeah, you said his name totally right. I thought you said <laughs> Teddy, like Cannibal or something. Yeah, what's, Teddy, what's Cannonball? Teddy Cannonball? What's Top Teddy? picture Teddy is Cannonball? Greg oh, Raymer arrested in Wake Forest <laughs> prostitution sting? What? Wow. Whoops. <laughs> well, did he kill anyone with a Conan the Barbarian style <laughs> sword? <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> yeah, the oh, the echo's show. here. Yep, it's oh. good. I think I'll just leave it on this time. But the second, the second picture is of him with Hello. the goggles. 
<laughs> I'm in the Grand Canyon. Canyon. <laughs> we got space for one more. If you, if anybody watching wants to get in, not anybody. We're I mean, like anybody in space. Yeah, yeah, anybody anybody important. Come on in. O only Nick is echoing to me. Right. Yeah, Did you, you are now echoed. I didn't invite well, anybody. But you I know. think I didn't see the chat, but I think Sinvicta was typing in the Skype chat. Yeah, he doesn't own this game though. Oh. Why what doesn't he own game? this? The only place to buy it is on G2A, and he's a man of honor. Yeah, mm. that's fair. Why do people always imitate an echo when there is an actual echo? It's pretty <laughs> weird, right? I was doing it to be funny, <laughs> but true. you're right. People yeah. do actually do that. Yeah. Hello. Hello. This is a very apt situation for this This is boys. the story of a fill in the blank. I you really guys aren't actually echoing. I unmuted you. Yeah, yeah. Let's do, oh, let's do a Mad Lib with that song. Okay, hold on. Okay, this I'm is gonna get the, the lyrics story up. of a girl vampire. Yeah, so noun. Give me a noun. You can't use the noun. This. <laughs> okay, this is <laughs> the story of a girl. Okay, hold on. Let me get the lyrics so I make Try sure you're right here. The whole Try world. to blank. So give me a uh, give me okay. like a land, a uh, uh, you know a structure in land, like a mountain or a river or something. River. Like that. River. River. Okay. <laughs> Uh, river. And uh, and drown the whole now now give me a planet world uh, world world <laughs> okay. the world planet <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah oh, this beautiful. is gonna be great all right ready this yeah. is the story of a vampire who cried a river and drowned the whole world <laughs> oh man wow what a goofy man. story <laughs> she looks so story. bad in photographs because oh, she's yeah. a vampire and is oh a oh, oh my god. You know, oh, man, I love Mad Libs. I really this like the part in that song. Jokes work. I like the part in that song where they've been baiting you the whole way. They're always going, "This is the story of a girl who cried." But then, like, they go at the end, they go, "This is the story of a girl." Yeah. They girl. wait. They wait like an extra, like half measure. The starting pistol signals the start of the race. The robot's trying to get me. He's done it. Fuck, fuck. Oh, I had a delayed start. I'm the worst player in the world. Jam. Did you just like do a chicken noise when you lost, or what happened there? Who? What is the fuck, name? Fuck. I said fuck. Ah. What's the name of the band that sings it's that band. song? Nobody knows. Space Jam. Space Jam. Now yeah. it's Ben. <laughs> Space Jam, yeah. since you looked at me. What's the name of the song? This is the Space story Jam. of a girl. This is this is Space Jam. Yeah. Okay. I'm not getting real answers from you guys. <laughs> Nobody knows it. It's like that band that sang uh, Breakfast at Tiffany's. Nobody knows the name of them. The right, name yeah. of it is Space called George. Absolutely. Oh come <laughs> on! I would not have guessed yeah. that. The the band is Nine Days. Yeah, it's about how popular they were. It's four <laughs> nine days since this. Oh, no, of course relevant. it's it's absolutely and then story of a girl in parentheticals. It would be way okay. too. And then in curly too... braces when she smiles, and then <laughs> Larry Moe and curly braces. <laughs> yeah. Way too presumptuous of them to, to just name it story of a girl, right? No, they couldn't, couldn't do that. It's like that five for fighting song. That's like you know. I can't stand to fly. And then you're like, the song's about being Superman, but it's actually called It's Not Easy. And then in parentheses, it says Superman. Yeah. Like, come on. Why don't you just call the song Superman? And they know they did that for SEO. They're not going to pull the fucking wool over my eyes. Yep. Exactly. Totally for SEO. You guys, uh... You guys got oh, your terrible. cool check marks, right? Yeah, I what? did. Oh, were those today? Yeah, look in Ryan's chat. I'll post now. Yeah, now that we're streamers that are not affiliates, we get special recognition that yep. we're streamers. Holy yeah. Wait, how do you do? How do you do you that? Gotta, you go to your badges. You gotta edit your badge. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get it. Gotta get it. Gotta get it. Good. No, you yeah, actually so just type Die Jawadiak in chat, and then yeah, uh, <laughs> it summons Die Jawadiak, the uh, Twitch verified <laughs> goblin who comes in. No. no. <laughs> I hate that guy. Uh, yeah. Did I someone summon me? <laughs> oh god! And if you say his name backwards, he bans your channel. How is uh, how's the audio now? I realized the problem was Discord was turned way down for it some It sounds good to me. <laughs> yes, banned. Is that the idea? <laughs> yes. <laughs> 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 
Do I have to die to Wajak? No, oh, I am, and I completely <laughs> fucked up this javelin throw because of it. Oh, there's my check. Channel oh, badge man. or global badge? Global, definitely. Foul. Oh god, timeout's coming. I still don't have. Oh no, it says I have it, but it hasn't. Hi, hi, the wizard. That's backwards. Die to Wajak. Ah, to Wajak. But um. You know why they did that is, you know, some uh, some partners are, like, pissed off that people are getting affiliates. Yeah. But I think it's, I like, know. I think it's, like, an extremely minor, like, very minority group of people that are, like, I hate yeah. this. And then the people who see it are myriad. So then they go, you know, like, you see a hundred people tweeting, I can't believe people are mad about this. There's right, actually yeah, just, like, right, one yeah. person out of every, like, 500 that's pissed. Mm, yeah. God damn it. Yeah, I was Still hoping no. they would just give me, like, room for six or seven more badges on the whole top line. Just let me have all the badges, and then just get rid of my name. Just all badges. Now, dude, Twitch is all about just badge collecting at this point. Yeah. You're, gonna, you're, you're gonna be yeah. one of those OG people that has, like, fucking badges from 2006. You gotta Hell be the yeah. real deal. They and gotta enable the ability to shine them, like, in Pokemon. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, I'm That's selling you... my Northern Lion Verified <laughs> Twitch badge. <laughs> I'm hoping to get five Twitch crates for it. So, Twitch drops, man. You got to keep yeah. your inventory stacked. What do the Twitch crates even give you? HMA. I don't. I don't know. Uh, they're unique emotes that only you have. Oh, I might buy one of those then. And sometimes think. you get uh, this. No. Oh, I fell. Wait. Am I right about that, Austin? That was my understanding, but I could be mistaken. Uh, apparently, sometimes you get bits. I, that's what they said. I don't know if they ended up did, doing it. But... No, like the, the emo part, though. Yeah, there's Broke a too. world Dude. record! Shit, nice. I guess I might have to pick up a couple of Twitch crates at twitch.tv slash alpaca patrol, because You know what you can do right you know, now is get 700 bits for $7. That's a savings of two bucks, uh... Robert. <laughs> so you buy... You can't buy sign anymore, you have bits now. All right. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was sighing because I was going to pimp Madrina's coffee, and I didn't get time. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I'm disappointed. See? It's a death spiral. I love any opportunity to promote delicious Madrina's coffee. Did he actually get that? Hold on. I got to check something. Get what? Oh, delicious my Madrina's God. Madrina's coffee? No, Eric G has a has a unique emote called Jack Chicken, and it looks pretty hilarious. Jack oh, damn. Chicken. Also, who is Eric G? G. He's a yeah, dude in my chat. It's a common chatter. I want a rare Eric G. Yeah, dude. Do. Or like a Jack Septic Eye emote. Is this real? Really... <laughs> you guys want to have like a really complex conversation right now while we're swimming? <laughs> oh no. No. Well, that's what I, I was really... gonna ask. Like, if this is really a swimming event, because Rob didn't ask which one is this. <laughs> yeah, you make a good point. Which one is this, though? I was not dedicated enough to caring about whether I win or lose to care which button I hit. That was so many to cares in that sentence. <laughs> Sorry, that I'm flooded. I'm yeah, super flooded right now. You're like mind flooding me out of third place, and I, I hate it, honestly. I totally Sorry. fucked up my swim. Oh, my God. Yeah. I guess it's flood or be flooded. What is this? What are people? Oh, it's a new Cosmos emote because it's yes. Cosmos on Twitch, right? It's now. a good thinking emote, I think. Yeah. Nick, have you seen that our gonna... our Twitter interaction went viral? I did. did. No, they you know what bothers me. When I oh, right. Yeah. To you. The one that says, yeah, like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Thank God, 420 is not on Friday the 13th on Friday this year. The 13th. And then Nick and said it was. Only it a was week off. Yeah, Nick said <laughs> it was really close too. But then when yeah. people go, congratulations, you're a meme. They just link us to the picture. They don't link us to the context. So I have no idea where the meme <laughs> is. And that's the whole point. It's like, right, yeah. Like, like okay, like, like this could just be a picture that you and your classmates made and then passed around, right. you know, the homeroom or something. Congratulations, someone put you in a picture. Yeah. Was it on Ellen? <laughs> if it wasn't on Ellen, I don't care. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool to be on Ellen. <laughs> yeah, you guys want to go on Ellen next week? I got yeah, sure. Ooh, I don't know what she's like. Yeah, I would go on Ellen. Go yeah, on Ellen. we probably too. work that into the schedule. Did That's what she's there for. We just talked about you know cum boxes for an hour. I'm sure she. <laughs> yeah. Does she hasn't been talking about this cum box. <laughs> well, as long she as we dance Schumer a little bit. On, so that was like we're like a step up from that. So I saw it on Instagram with like 8k likes. What? Wow. That's crazy. Wow. Really? <laughs> That's hilarious. 
So we're like an actual meme, not just like somebody found us on Facebook. Yeah, but they also, you're a meme because they think you're idiots. That's fine. We are. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, but who's the idiot? Point. The person pretending to be an idiot or the person who doesn't realize that we're pretending to be idiots? Both. The person who's pretending to be an idiot, probably, yeah. It was also on r slash facepalm. That tells me everything I need to know about that subreddit. <laughs> we're making waves lately. I People got are so stupid. Fails. Now we're memes. <laughs> Wait, were you on live stream fails? Yeah, I was on live stream fails because I accidentally kicked Rob off a Left 4 Dead game. Oh, yeah, he did do that. I I I get on there like once like every couple days now, and people are getting mad at that. Oh, they're like, we need a we need a last gray wolf filter. No, they're they they I keep getting like called out like I'm faking. I did like, see that. Got, yeah, and I'm just sitting here like I'm not even submitting these. I don't. <laughs> Like, it's like, what do you mean? I'm faking being on stream? I don't understand. <laughs> well, you should just stop faking, dude, and then maybe Yeah, I guess I'm just a big faker. Yeah. Big phony. You guys, you gotta, like, once you start getting locked down into, like, a specific meme, you're gonna, it's like becoming a character actor. Like, you don't want to do that online, you know? Like, I can't escape my Steven Weber credit <laughs> still <laughs> yeah. to this day. Nice dive, It Robert. persists. <laughs> yeah, we really put some good numbers up there at the end. Are you, there, yeah, did you guys forget how to play? Yeah, uh, I just bricked it. I did one of those things where I pressed the B button. It's like, no, you didn't, though. And I was like, all right, I guess I didn't do that. Donkey! I Donkey! totally belly flopped on that yeah. one. My timing is like oh. just slightly off. Mm -hmm. He pumped his fist. I got a 10. Wow. They need to do that thing. Wow. You, can they get the next patch for this game where they, where they have the little circle going into the prompt so you know when you're supposed to hit it perfectly? The punchline was the next patch for this game. Yes, exactly. I like putting my punchlines <laughs> in the middle of jokes now instead yeah. of at the end. <laughs> Just to see how it works out. That's a 10. Oh, you, oh, you didn't press left stick when I pressed left stick. Hey, nice yeah. dive, bear. Thanks. Hey, nice dick, bear. Thanks. Yeah, you can really see I, the I feel, outline I, of their whole dick. I kind of want to stop talking about live stream fail, though, because that's actually like a terrible subreddit. I go to it every day, though. But, yeah. like, the people on it are terrible. Mm. And the titles for all the threads are terrible. And it's just really bad, actually. <laughs> Have you, you guys not noticed term? that? No, Have you I not noticed sometimes they're not fails? Yeah, most of the time they're not fails. Like, 90% of them aren't fails. They'll just, they'll do, it's just somebody playing a game. <laughs> oh, yeah. something happened. All right, oh, next person. Yeah. The only time I'm, like, disappointed in it is when I I think it's going to be a cool clip, and then I load it up, and it's just some nerd going, like, roo, 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 and I'm like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> not this, right, not this faker again. <laughs> oh, how do you know? Oh, oh I hate go, this yeah. one. Oh, I hate this it. is the I sound I like to hear from everyone at once. Yeah. Oh, I fucked this up so bad. I can't believe I fucked up such a shitty one. Oh, okay, never mind. Livestream fails actually should be renamed to Livestream Funny Moments. Because that's Shit. what it is. It's not nearly as concise. If you nail yeah, the sure. progress bar at the beginning, like way past where it needs to be, do you get extra stability later, do you think? Yes. Probably, yeah. You do? I think so. Okay. Yeah, really I didn't know if there was a reward for that or not. The mental state of the lifter really does oh. come into... I completely forgot to look at the stats after. <laughs> Shit. Rip. The sticks. It's always the sticks. No, bullshit! Bullshit! <laughs> Come on! I've always oh, yeah, got it! I've always He's got it down, perfect, and then they just go, eh. See, I've <laughs> never failed the mashing parts. I've only ever failed the fucking sticks parts. Uh, sorry, you your check thing. didn't cash from the Russian judge. Uh, I saw his elbow buckle you a little. Do you get intense anxiety when you have to press the sticks up at the same time? Because it's oh, like, yeah, it's that, I always I nail that one. I just clear my mind. There's I no reason to be scared of that. 
Oh, the mashing hurts the tips of my dick. What? Whoa, Dude, I fucked that up. I don't know, man. It's the sticks. It's 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 oh, bullshit. It's bullshit. It's Power and stern! It's the fucking sticks, dude. Why does Howard Stern always X me? Oh, no. I don't even... Easy. Actually, as far as I'm concerned, Rob, you get a gold medal and be a beta bitch who doesn't go for the world record. Nick, you get the silver. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he beat me. I mean, you went for 216, so... You, you, you set the bar low, my friend. Literally. Because <laughs> this no, that would be That would be if it were high jump, then you would set the bar low. <laughs> no, I wasn't shaking. I was hitting the button real fast, so it looked weird. <laughs> I I shake like I'm on with, or I'm having withdrawals every time I play this. Mm -hmm. so yeah, I don't know where you're gonna go with this. Spaz out. <laughs> withdrawals from your bank account? Hey -o! Yeah, hey -o. that's a weird joke, right? Hey oh. <laughs> boom boom, 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 boom. Taxes, Everybody am say I right? Ho. Boom boom boom. Everybody say way ho. I refuse. Way ho. <laughs> Thanks, Bear. You can't you make me. Yeah. Tell me what to do. <laughs> All right. How about that? Cash you know, money outside, how about that? Yeah, exactly. How about that? Did you know that lady, I use that word loosely, <laughs> has an what? ad on her Instagram page. It says, cash me drinking fit tea and nothing else. How about that? Hashtag ad. Of course. It has yeah. 9.8 million views. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, I'm an actual idiot. Oh, oh my come God. on. Come on! Give me a break. Is it too early or too late, game? That was awful. Yeah, well, he's done. No, that was the worst hurdle that was so in awful. human history. <laughs> they would be booing us. <laughs> this is incorrect. <laughs> Be like, go again. Yeah, go again. Yeah, I think in 14 <laughs> seconds got first place. There's a huge we might problem. As, we might as well have all just fucking collapsed in the center of the <laughs> when, arena. <laughs> when they show the wide shot, oh. you can see how many we fucked up at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> Do people ever hit the hurdles at the Olympic hurdles? I have Maybe seen once some. in a blue moon? There's sometimes they hit the hurdle and then they like fall into the other lane and trip the other rider and like. Nice. Oh, that's rider. gotta suck. Well, yeah. the other yeah. rider. <laughs> what, what, what are you fucking <laughs> runner? <laughs> what are you running? They're not running. They're, not running, they're jumping. Uh, running. The other, Almost the other athlete. The other word would be the good. other athlete. <laughs> the other rider. <laughs> the other rider. Is there like another creature doing these hurdles on top of no, the people dude, that we don't know? When you compete know? at that level, your shoes are considered a vehicle. Exactly. Oh. Oh. Right. Okay, I didn't consider that. Yeah. Oh, fucking <laughs> leg drivers. Oh, the three circles. Look, if you solve a problem with the three circles after this long, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I know. It's just left, right, left. Yeah, I can right? see the three circles now, but like, I still can't do this well. Also, I need the power of Di. What's his name? Diameridium. Oh, Di Wajak. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Di Wajak. <laughs> you summon me <laughs> to verify your identity. I your woods. <laughs> Yeah, I just yeah. I just adore discus at this point. I adore it as well. <laughs> oh, 69 I win. Left in this competition to do it. Well done. Ty what? Ty Antwood? Shit. Oh, the power lock's so bad. The oh, but I got a perfect. Oh, like such a oh. gentleman. Shit on my asshole. Oh, angle. What a bitch. fucking waste. Some guy was killed by a hammer throw yesterday. Oh my god. Really? Well, okay. That's an awful way to go, unless you're Thor. <laughs> Wait, well, unless you're a recipient of Thor. A I think that word is, is <laughs> Sounds like Thor a... Is victim. <laughs> like a... That's what you're looking for. A cult. <laughs> You've never been a recipient of Thor. <laughs> oh man. It just died as soon as it hit the ground. Oh, don't you start this with this our feet shoe shit. <laughs> nice throw, Nick. <laughs> yeah, that's I suck at this. <laughs> Ooh, I'm gonna throw this like it's a paying customer on my United flight. <laughs> oh! oh! Ooh! Ooh! Ah! <laughs> Kate, why are you playing? <laughs> <laughs> 
How am I getting worse? Yeah, you guys can you just give up now, I think. Yeah, I hate this case, honestly. Oh, I'm out of focus. I'll 74 is really good, Austin. Just Thank stop you. picking discus. Dude, it's a fun event, plus you get the three nah. circles. It's no three good. Three circles are pretty cool. Good. Yeah, pretty good. Cool. Cool. Like cool. 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 <laughs> My guy just did a pirouette and he didn't actually throw the discus. Excellent. God damn it. On the second Austin, bounce, where are you? Past. Where are you thrusting the left thumbstick into? Up and right. On 25 degrees. 45 degrees, huh? Okay. Yeah. It's a good position to be That's pretty cool. You gotta, you gotta line it up with the thing. It's like <laughs> different things. You gotta line up the arrow, and then you also have to hit 45 degrees. Like, I feel like I understand that, but it just doesn't happen. Well, then I still win good. if we end on, and I'm on 69. Oh, high angle. Do it, do it, do it. Gyroscopic stability. Oh. Oh, that's a 12 degree angle. <laughs> <laughs> First throw was my best throw. Go on to that one. A polished, polished, performance. A polished, polished performance. I hear that line a lot. They love that. Sadly. Is. Jamaica! I was playing Madden the other day, and the commentators say, like, the weirdest shit. Like, the dude just makes stuff up. He makes up phrases. Like... Okay, one of them, he says, you know what they say, Di uh, pressure creates diamonds, but it also bursts pipes. No! No one says that! No one says, no one says also, that! Also, how is that applicable to the to the football situation? I don't know. I, I have no idea. Are you sure that's not just, like, Phil Simms doing the voice? Like, No, it's some guy. They got rid of Phil Simms, actually. I can't believe Phil Simms was replaced by Tony Romo. That's like the greatest news I've ever heard in my life. Oh my god, is that true? You didn't know that? Yeah, it's gonna no. be Tony Romo and not Phil Simms. Oh god, that gives that's me That's actually wonderful. Boner. Yeah, that's fantastic. And wonderful. Phil Simms was like pissed about it too. He was like, I kind of don't like this. So. <laughs> yeah, of course Phil Simms would. Yeah, of course the dude who lost his job. <laughs> he had his fucking chance, Ryan. <laughs> what an yeah, asshole. Phil Simms. What? Don't say stupid shit on the main stage. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the main stage. You know, I, like, I like this being the main stage. Coming up on the main stage, Phil Simms. <laughs> they cut off another, his new album. You know, it's another phrase that they say is the Madden commentary. This, this, this happens at the end or the beginning of every preseason game. Is he goes like, uh, yeah, our national nightmare is over. And, and the other guy chimes in and he goes, uh, yeah, this is a lot better than Watergate, huh? I was like, well, what? 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 Like, yeah, huh? it is, I guess. But, I mean, like, so are a lot of things, though, aren't yeah. there? <laughs> like, isn't most things Oddly better specific. than Watergate? Yeah. <laughs> What's worse than Watergate? Yeah, probably, like, you know. Don't say it. The Armenian Genocide or well, something. Well, yeah, okay. Yeah, all right. <laughs> yep. Bad sex. I, well, no. I mean, I don't know. Watergate is, is much worse. Water <laughs> Two point four six. That's yeah, that's pretty wild. What's going on over there, guys? I mean, just living my life, you know. Do you have springs for legs now? All right, fuck it. Here we go. Yep, yeah, all the way. Yeah. Might as well. Never gonna get it, but who cares? I mean, that's the kind of attitude that makes you lose all the time. Exactly. To be honest. Exactly. <laughs> Oh, that speed lock was bad, apparently. No, too high, too high, too hot, too hot. Oh, I'll give up. Just walk past it. Don't even. Oh, oh, you can't oh! how do I do it then? So Filson still has a job. He'll still be casting games. I want him on the street. I I do. <laughs> I want him killed. No, I don't. I don't want that at all. I say we let him go. Oh, so it's land range for you. Much. I can't wait for the rest of the board to be filled with X's. <laughs> Thanks yeah, that's for where it's going. No, I gotta go. Of reason, Pillsbury, Rob. I gotta go what fucking 2.42 because I know Don't these. Be a little bitch, no, Ryan. but these beta yeah. fucks are gonna try to come in and then like get 2.46 and tie me. All right. Yeah. Do 2.6. No, you're the ship. I'm the barnacle, and they're like the zebra mollusks or something that are eating the barnacles. That's I the kind of attitude that Dude, I knocked the bar off with my fucking forehead when I attempted this job. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, I actually that. got perfect angle and perfect speed lock, and my dude still didn't clear the the, the pole. So. Like it yeah, actually gets like, knocked off by my head. Damn. For real. You, you're you're jumping like either too late or too early, like way too late or way too early. Where, when are you supposed to jump on this? Right when your dude's foot like hits the little carrot on the mark. I thought I was doing, but I guess not. Oh, I just put it up point two more. Great, that's great. <laughs> Whoops. The analog stick just. Nope. Slipped. Going under that one. Good angle, not perfect. Doesn't matter. When the Dude, if I hit this 2 6, I'll be a fucking god, though. That is true. What? What? He jumped a mile early! My analog stick. Ah! He jumped so early, it was perfect, and I fucked it. Yes, that was a big adventure. Fuck. Rip. <laughs> <laughs> yes, indeed. Remember pump meta. What is pump meta? <laughs> That's from uh, PUBG. Yeah, I know, but like, how am I supposed to pump in this? <laughs> to release the parachute early. So many options to go for oh well, that's a dead jump right there. Let me just. Uh... I've heard. Oh my uh, god! Okay, I actually perfect, I, lost perfect angle again. I didn't knock it off with my head. I'm feeling good about that. That's that's a that's a plus. This analog stick's a problem for me. Ultimately a failure, but Come on, dude. Absolutely right. Well, this game's a lot fuck, better than Fuck! Fuck! Ah! Damn. Nope. Just throw yourself on the throw yourself on the clay. That's what you. <sighs> that's where you on belong. the last jump, Spike should just come out of the mat. <laughs> yeah. Just yeah. Compel him. They should do Mortal Kombat Olympics 2012. <laughs> I'd be Chad, don't even start with me. Everything uh, in chat right now basically boils down to, well, why don't you just hit it at the perfect angle instead of that one? <laughs> There's a mechanical really aspect to it. You can really see where all the hope just went away. Like, <laughs> yeah, thanks, man. Look at that board of X's. <laughs> Look at that board of X. Now I don't get no sex. That thanks, Jen. Better than that was what that was for? If you had a yeah, whole board of X, you'd have a lot of sex. I didn't realize the winner of the high jump was the only one that got to have sex anymore. That's not yeah. fun. That is how it works, yeah. Yeah. Oh, and apparently it? they all like bang a lot in the uh Yeah, we just read that in an yes. Yeah, stop. Just a massive orgy of yeah. athletes. Look at this graph. It's more like, look at this graph. All right, hear me out. Hear me out on this one. Hear me out yeah. on this one. I I I don't like this game. Why? Do you why? I, don't yeah, like I love this, this game. This Wait, is one of my not, favorite ones. You don't this, like skeet? skeet shoot? I don't like skeet anymore. Why? It's just not fun. Well, why not though? Nah, it's just Pressure's not, like, too much I, for I, you. I, I, I reckon. No, it takes now a lot you're gonna, of concentration. This is such an easy argument for you to make. It's just, just to make me a little beta bitch about it. Well, this, I mean, like, it's really like a mental game. So, I mean, you just gotta, like, not fuck up. And, like, it's I am crazy. so happy you two are on this side of the argument because it's perfect. It makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you catch me outside in a uh, 100 meter pistol? Because mm -hmm. I still haven't lost that. Oh, dude, instead of throwing a discus, they should just shoot each other. Yeah. All right, I'm going to try hitting one with my eyes closed now. If we could launch the other competitors out of a can <laughs> and shoot them. All right, pull. That's a fun game. Yeah, you know what they say. Pressure creates diamonds, but it also bursts pipes. <laughs> That's a lot better of a joke than Watergate That's... was, I'll tell you. Oh, I thought that guy was shirtless out cheering for me as I but shoot I discs. He had a flesh-colored shirt on. Nice, nice. All right, here we go. Okay. But this is like I talked about this in the Hollow Knight video recently. Ah, I don't fuck. like the I don't like the challenges in games where it's like it's a gauntlet of having to perform consecutive actions successfully in a row. Oh, right. Someone was doing Arena Three. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and I know what you're talking about. And if you, like you you when you're doing those things, it's like rounds one through seventy five of one hundred. At, at attempt three or four, they yeah. become pretty yeah. trivial, right? Like, it's like, okay, yeah, this is no longer a challenge. It's just it's just an endurance race until I get to the part that's actually difficult. This, however, is like you're doing round one of those challenges 80 times, 
and if you miss one, you lose because everyone else yeah. is going to hit every single shot. What was great about Arena 3 also is that it was like 20 minutes long. So it's like a really long practice period over and over forever. And the, the best part is that you guys cannot have a conversation with me right now because you're too focused Three on times hitting up. every shot. I can have a conversation. I appreciate the background no, noise. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm just trying to answer. That's so good. <laughs> Austin? And that's what you get. <laughs> uh, I missed the first one before you even Me started and talking. On top. And we were the ones talking. <laughs> nah, you guys, you know, anybody can get it. The hard part is keeping it, motherfucker. Uh, yeah, mm hmm. This is the world premiere. Dude, this is the world premiere. You listen Ryan, to it. You got Dan Giesling. What do you mean, though? Bear mind flooded you so hard you lost. I lost oh, before he even mind flooded. Oh. And as far also, as I'm concerned, we've not we lost lose yet. honorably. At least we were like, Whoa. oh, I hate being this forced to sucks. be consistent as an adult. Anytime someone dislikes something, <laughs> it's like, oh, I'm a little baby. I don't like this thing. <laughs> Lose At least we're not like Rob makes one mistake and it's like, well, I'd rather get a zero on the rest of this. <laughs> I'm trying to hit it with my eyes closed. I think that's a noble goal. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, do you well, miss one? You have your webcam on. I don't want to hear it. Make one mistake and then just decide like I don't even want to try anymore. I'll just get a zero instead. You make one mistake, you lose in this not game. Not necessarily, dude. Not Look necessarily. What do you think the real Olympics? We're is not like, losing you know? the game. We're losing, but the game's not over yet. <laughs> well, okay, yeah, well, I'd like to see you in the last round. No pressure, Bear. No pressure, oh. Nick. I'm feeling good. Just stay frosty. I got a little rattled on that one, but I didn't miss. <laughs> I'm fine, I'm just saying. Man. Last round. It's a subpar game when we've got so many other exciting options available to us. This, I have it all comes five. down to the last moment, oh, though. No, right. <laughs> I heard that one from over here. That I'm one. closing my eyes, chat. Don't worry. Fucking G. Thanks for the free bronze. Oh, there's one more. There's one more. Wait. Oh, fuck. I thought I got it. Damn. <laughs> Ryan, what happened? I missed the first one again. I missed it! Told you. <laughs> Told you. Told you. Told you. Perfect game! Yeah. yeah. Second time I've done that. That's, oh, that's I made feeling. two mistakes. It would have been better to not even try. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when well, you I mean, have you to be middle. perfect to win, you know, it's just kind of, if you make the one mistake, it's like, what's the point, you know? Well, I can't play. I got silver. I got points, dude. I missed. Yeah. I didn't give up. Exactly. You missed you miss one at the end. I missed, one at the, I missed the third one. What are you talking about? Brought home the yeah. gold for the boys in green. See, archery is, like, far better. Yeah. Archery is great, too. I like in this In most well. measures. Because no, archery agree. always has a sense of, like, competition to it. Yeah, just mm -hmm. like uh, just like skip pistols. Yeah, it's actually twenty-five meter pistols. Wait, oh, I for forgot how to do this again. Yeah, me too. <laughs> See, I like. How do, how do you shoot? Uh, hold you back on right stick, and then just let it go. And let it go after you aim, yeah. All right, got it. Ah, nine. They need to just flash the controls like for a second. Oh, you got a yeah. nine, Rob? I Better just want. close your eyes and then. <laughs> this is a different game mode. Also, I did get an eight because he mind flooded me. Uh, well, now you should give up. Yeah, for sure. Game mode. <laughs> if I got ten. try ten. That's pretty good. Yeah. Terrific. It's a completely different game mode. That one you have you have, you shoot like thirty times, and if you fuck up one, yeah, one, you're you're pretty I'm, much I'm with like Rob. out. Like that's I'm with like, Rob. yeah, like. So who, why why is people suddenly giving me shit for closing my eyes and doing it? Who cares? Suddenly. Because I don't want to close my eyes. Mm. I don't want to fall asleep because yeah. I miss you, baby. Kind of like Robert oh, missed those oh, targets. Dang. Another eight. You keep I'm mind flooding me. Oh, I'm double not perfect. <sighs> that hurts, actually. All right. Well, I got my ten. Seven miles per hour go. so fast. Okay, got the ten. Here we go. We got a Game Boys. Game Boys. Yeah. Game I Boys. One of those. I still own one of those. Game Boys. I got a Game Boy, and then I got a Game Boy Color. Yeah. Did you get a Game I Boy Pocket? I skipped the Pocket and the Advance. What about you the Micro? Skip the Advance? Yeah, dude. For the, the SP. Advance. That's insane. Did you have an SP? Nah. 
What? Oh, you missed out, dude. That's and who is the greatest handheld? Brilliant. Zero Five. miles per hour? Oh, that's a mystery. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! I got an eight on that one! Ten, Zero, ten and I missed? See, on this one, there could be huge swings in points. Yeah! We're within four, all of us. Mm -hmm. Might as well just close your eyes. Oh, fuck. Well, <laughs> screw when you get a fucking hurricane. Yeah. Let's go, Arlene. Ooh, Let's right go. Right on the dot, baby. Let's go, yeah. Arlene. Let's go. He's delighted um, with the start. What? Uh, no, 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 something's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, like my oh. my bow tension is like all fucked up. Let's go, Arlene. Let's go. All right, ten, ten, nine. Shamrocks and chat. Shamrocks and chat. Here we go. That's so offensive. <laughs> <laughs> like if I said, okay, Canada. Skates in chat, please. What? Oh, the uh, swing! Silver, baby! You see what I'm talking about? I got a six on my last shot! How the <laughs> fuck did that happen? <laughs> don't, 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 the swing! Oh, oh, oh my god. One, two, 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 five. Support from the stands. Oh, nice medals, Robert. <laughs> That's a nice feeling. Yeah, Losing to so Austin good. with a reasonable amount of points is a good feeling. <laughs> Dude, I discovered... This is totally tangential. I discovered a new delivery service, and it has like a hundred fucking restaurants on it. I'm so excited. Really? Was it not... What is it, Uber Eats or something? No, it's called DoorDash. It's called Uber Ah, uh, Okay, yeah. It has way more restaurants. Yeah, because what DoorDash yeah, does is um, they, they deliver from restaurants that don't deliver because they just hire their own drivers, basically. That's the greatest thing. I don't know why it's not with Grubhub. You guys ever hear of, you guys ever hear of Jordash? <laughs> no. They make this jeans? Single, single jump? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Get fucked, get oh, fucked, get fucked. Oh, no, I don't want to be fucked right now. I fucked. hate this jump. <laughs> oh, it's so fell. impossible. Why does he never jump? <laughs> I've never had that issue. Second attempt. I get this problem where my guy will just run past the line over and over again. Yeah. yeah I know you guys do. It's weird. I've never I had... don't understand. It just oh, happened. happened. It just happened again. Why? Did I just dream? I think I dream big. Oh, no. That's actually not that impressive. <laughs> <laughs> look on his face. <laughs> wow. Goodness me. It really is ties at the top. And like when I try to jump earlier, he jumps a fucking foot ahead of the line, dude. Oh, I don't yeah. get it. It happened again. Yeah, that wasn't good. You guys just like, are you hitting the right direction on the stick? I am taking mm. my left stick and pushing it up and le and right. Yeah. Have you ever taken and your tapping, left stick and moved it. it all out? Up and right? Up and right? Mm hmm. Have you ever you taken it, your left it, right? stick and acted a fool? No. Up and right? Up and right? It's one of those games, you just won't jump. Yeah, no, you ever I had to jump a foot video. before the line. That's the only option I had. You ever lost it might be like pool? a frame rate thing or something. Yeah, that. Oh, that's that totally awesome. a foul. I this swear to God, garbage. I pressed it every time. That wasn't a foul! Oh, it was still easy. Still <laughs> <wasn't a foul. laughs> it keeps giving me the line as if the line is the metric, but the, the line doesn't mean anything because I jumped like a foot over the fucking line. Five rounds without jumping once! It's gonna be like a frame rate thing. I Black. don't get it, dude. It's so fucking oh, broken. He wrong Didn't even yeah, I know I sprinted even... through the board. You don't have to tell me that. I told you to get fucked. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you guys might jumping. as well have closed your eyes after that last part. <laughs> Why do you care so bad about what happens on Yo, yo, shooting. Jamaica, post your islands in chat, please. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a colon island? <laughs> Colon Island. Colon. Oh, they, we're just no. going to fucking triple Island. jump now, aren't we? No. Dude, I, I, I hell yeah. yeah. Supreme in triple one. jump. <laughs> I love triple jump. I think triple jump works better. It's yeah, just long it jump that's fucked. Might be a frame rate issue. I think issue. it's fucked. I think you're making an issue. They're making a Jamaican. 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 Oh, you might as well just go home. Straight up. Oh, He's done it again. Orange line. 
Oh, you oh 8.1. Okay, yeah, we'll see how that holds up. And then to overcompensate <clears throat> for him running over the line, I start so early. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go, then. Round two. Uh, 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 uh. Here we go, boys. Oh, yep, go home. Go home. What? Oh, my God. What the hell was that second one? Eighteen point no seventeen. That's quite high. If you guys play this game at home, I recommend you buy a new 360 controller for it. Mm. If your if your analog stick's a little jittery or old, it's not gonna be good. Oh, I fucked that up so bad. I hate it, but I did get sixty nine degrees on the last one, so I pretty oh, that's good. We have a winner. Yeah, Makes it worth it. There, Ryan, we should put this. That's a house rule right there. Six months in a row. Thank you, sir. My problem is I did two jumps and broke the world record, but they disqualified me. <laughs> they said, were ready. They said there has to be a third jump. Wasn't there Fuck, actually uh, the last one up. thinking of uh, breaking a world record? Wasn't there a guy in the draft this year, the NFL like, draft, who ran like a four four one eight forty or something? Isn't that like oh, ridiculous? He's on the board. Yeah, it's, it's like he ran like super fast in the in the forty yard this year. I, I thought think. like the hold on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the record was like Chris Johnson, I think. Yeah, I thought it was like a four point three or something. He's yeah, improving like so consistently. Look at my scores. <laughs> <laughs> you will not make these jumps, you jackass. Jackass. Mathematically, I'll beat you on this jump. Oh, John Ross 422. Okay, that's crazy. Yeah, I mean, Bob that's Ross 420. <laughs> oh, please. Praise it. God damn it, so consistent. You know, Bob Ross originated the term happy little trees. Mm. Look how consistent that improvement is. Yeah, if only we did infinity jumps, you would have caught me eventually. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, streamer, infinity doesn't work that way. <laughs> did you know if we had a universe that was Googleplex size big, then we would actually see a repeat of planet Earth with our exact uh, likenesses and experiences? Really? Nah. Yeah, yeah, it's a it's a number file video. So like an actual parallel um, dimension, but yeah, like in it's, the same it's dimension. Number file? Are a, you kidding me? <laughs> it's such a large number that mathematically there aren't enough particles in space and orders you could put them in. There's the also yeah. not. But why would they repeat though? There's also not because enough there's weed not a, to smoke to make that relevant. Mm -hmm. All I'm playing is Kevin Bacon. I have to win. It would repeat because you'd get every combination and eventually you would just run out of combinations. Exactly. Exactly. Wait, I get that part, but I don't know why that means you would get more of the same. Oh, it's a double. Because you problem. run out of things. Nick, how many ways Wait. can a coin land? I'm mind flooded. Sorry, I can't process it. <laughs> right Working hard here. We got mind really good stroking. Oh, it's a close one. I don't know if chat's like, Rob's wrong, but if not, though, is the thing. Yeah, chat, he saw it on YouTube. <laughs> Some mathematics, you can't argue with math. Stroke, 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 stop. Stroke, stroke, stroke. I stroke, stroke. Have a stroke. stroke. Have a stroke. Have a stroke. Have a stroke. 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 Have a stroke. Not equal four. Chat says the boys are wrong about that. Oh. So. Guess who just got so back today? And those Jamaican boys and they hit a swim. <laughs> new PB. Okay, explain it to me again. So we got a Googleplex universe, and uh -huh. we run out of particles, so we see the same universe a second time. Nick, hear me no, out here. Like, you flip a coin twice. How many yeah. different outcomes can you get? Heads, 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 tails, 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 right? Heads, tails, 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 heads, tails, tails, heads. Well, I mean, two of them are. Oh, I thought you meant each iteration of... Okay, go ahead. I understand. Yeah, so what happens if you flip two coins one more time? You're guaranteed to get a duplicate. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah, I don't know how that maps to what we're talking about, though. There's no more uh, possible permutations for the matter to be configured in except to make us again. Yeah, it's just the... the uh... A Googleplex is so large of a number. Ah, there. <laughs> yeah, I'm just done here. Yeah. Eyes closed time. Salt liquors for the nine months. I hit a nine on both my first targets, and at that point, I actually just said fuck it because it's done. It, it's done from there.
Oops. Ah, fuck. Oh, double fuck. I'm gonna start firing into the crowd. Oh, no. <laughs> oh god, don't do that. <laughs> it's okay, it's only got a uh, zeroing distance of 25 meters. Six seconds to hit five targets. Pressure's on. I'm hit, I'm shooting the same target. Why did I do that one so fast? Brilliant. That was stupid. Oh, my brain was playing four eight. seconds instead of six seconds. Just the one eight. Fuck me. But like, what about entropy? What about entropy? What do you mean? Well, you can't just say a term and have it apply. <laughs> Chaos, man. Yeah, but like, there's you're, like, you're accounting Googleplex. for entropy in that. <laughs> Is what so about entropy? <laughs> <laughs> no answer. What about entropy? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Fuck! This is the first chance I have at losing. Yeah, I, I'm the... fucking close, baby. Not closing my eyes Whoa. on this one. Yeah, this push him over the time. edge, chat. He's close. Six, finally, time. Final He's throwing in big words. In. Well, I do at least know what entropy means. <laughs> It's time. I fucked it up so oh, bad. Oh no, but I fucked it up. He's already oh, fucked it up enough. Oh, oh not God, done it. He's fucked not it up done. on the last one. I'm so mad. Oh, fuck. It doesn't matter anyway because CERN used the Large Hadron Collider to create a Mandela universe. So like all the shit that we thought we remembered incorrectly from our childhood is actually us remembering the original universe correctly, and then CERN ripped a hole in time and space and inserted us into the Mandela dimension. Yeah. What I about it? I hate this. Yeah, but but what about what it? about <laughs> Andrew? <Andrew's laughs> <laughs> <laughs> I like how the graphs are completely unrelated. Yeah, totally. Like, guys. Yeah, <laughs> so bears. <laughs> no, but someone's bears. like talking about IHOP or something. Like, yeah, I went to IHOP and some great pancakes. You know, the sauce is really good. What about entropy? <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! I actually forgot about one of the gates. I just blew straight by. Oh, that's by good it. news. Classic. Oh, I swung that one way too wide though. I just bypassed the gate mostly because of entropy. <laughs> But what about it, though? Exactly. Well, this next gate's a toughie. It's upstream. I forgot he how to roll for a second. Never said. I'm afraid to say. Well, it took an awful You're telling me that was a penalty? Actually got through that gate. Had to fight to get back through that upstream gate. <laughs> well, they actually that was repeated. was a hard one to get through. <laughs> he actually repeated, did well to get through that gate twice. He was like, <laughs> did well to get through that gate. Did well to get through that gate. <laughs> well, doing well. <laughs> He's still doing really well. Hey, up, <laughs> so did well to get through that gate as well. That also gate, well in this gate, well very well, very well. well. Piccadilly <laughs> Circus. <laughs> a spot of tea. Spotted dick, am I right? Skid! Custard and raisins or something, it's not a dick. Yeah, but it should be though. Hey, here's my impression of someone from England. Hey, can I have a spotted dick and a bit of a Welsh rare bit, please? Fucking <laughs> <laughs> stupid. Got him. <laughs> Welsh rare bit is. I've heard of it before, though. Oh, God. Oh, good. Man. Damn it. <gasps> oh, my PB. I wonder how poorly I did. My PB! <laughs> I actually got third with my PB. My PB fell off. <laughs> I don't know why I got penalties. I accidentally finished what I didn't mean to yet. Oh, I prematurely finished. All because of that one gate. All because of entropy. <laughs> Can I just blame entropy for all my problems in life? But what about it, though? <laughs> I'm just saying, England's got it backwards. You should drink Spotted Dick. That sounds like the name of a trendy craft beer. And you should eat Old Speckled Hen. Nice. What is an Old Speckled Hen? It's a bad it's beer. The name of my dick. That sounds like a nice. bad food. You have an old speckled dick? No. <laughs> old speckled hen, that's the name of my dick. I mean, we're all gonna have old speckled dicks eventually, to be honest with you, so. That's when you show them proudly in the gym locker room. Fuck. Wow, Austin. Took you five medals to beat me. I only needed two to get up there. Or three. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Easy rares. Let's Easy do, rare uh, bit. let's do that. Sideways. Boat one. Don't. 
Don't Kieran. do it. Kieran. Kieran. No, not oh, Kieran. Uh, Kieran fucking... Is it Kieran? No, men's single skulls. Skulls. It's yeah, there you so go. Bad. Oh, fucking no. Halo. So fucking oh. Of Halo. oh, my God. We're going to do skulls and then trampoline? Oh, kill <laughs> Yeah, me. this is hell. Oh, Jesus. Y'all made me go through fucking long jump and shot put bullshit. Or That's not shot put. Sideways it's just... one. Yeah. <laughs> I, actually, I actually hate skulls, but I'll do it. I'll do it for you. <laughs> Thanks. Skulls is the worst. Skulls no, is exactly the same as skeet shooting, by the way. No, it's, it's not. one pattern executed like rhythmically over and over. Night, Lynn. So is this like, running game? Yeah. Yeah. So it's like all like. But what about entropy, though? <laughs> yeah. That's a good start. Actually, the running game has a little bit of a strategic yeah. element to it with the sprinting. There's a meta to this one. Robert, you're fucked. Oh, I know. But I'm actually in third place. Second place. Oh. Uh, the robot's beating the even. Oh, no. What do I do wrong in this game? The final part of this wonderful event is the world witnesses Olympic history. Oh, oh God, God, I heard his shin snap. No! Oh my God! Oh. Jamaica! I just got calculated it by a oh. Jamaica. Of second. Oh my God! Oh. See, that was great. That's not oh. like fucking skeet shooting at all. That's how we do it down on the island. Four <laughs> seconds. Gosh, I was so. Do you, Nick, with the 400 meter, do you do like the the sprinting management where you like yeah. go full full speed and then kind of get it back into the green? I use it as hard as I can until it's almost out and then I go back to stabilizing and then I wait and then I go back to fast again. Mm. Yeah. That's the idea. But I'm like way behind you guys. Mm. I blame Entropy. Yeah, that's I also good. Who does it? Oh, I fucked this up so bad. Oh, I forgot it's the A mash. I totally forgot. Yeah, go home. Yeah, Just yeah. go home. Oh, Tiger Woods, baby. Okay, if it gives me Tiger Woods for this, I'm beginning to think the threshold oh, no, for Tiger, Tiger Woods on Tiger shot put is like every nothing. Time. Yeah. yeah. Just it's go home. like within three, right? Fuck off, Ryan. I got you. I'm not going home. Go home. What is the Save your perfect strength. angle? 35 here? Save your strength. Yeah, 35. Thirty-four ah, is not. 30. It. I hit up and it said thirty-five, and I swear it was like a fucking arcade game. It dropped to thirty-four after. <laughs> uh, that was bullshit. You got it's like those fucking right. stacker arcade games. Yeah. No, you get the things. the block lined up perfectly, and then just all of a sudden one pixel over. Oh hey, I actually got on the board. Nice, nice, nice. This just in Irish jaw crack accidentally wanders into the Olympics. That's pretty much how I felt, yeah. Ah, He's done. No, you six. actually go home. This is a new Uranus no. record. How is this worse? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> how is a perfect no, angle not. worse I than a good angle? Four, five, six. I'm not letting you mind flood me. <laughs> it might also have to do with how quickly you fill up the bar at the beginning, Bear. It does. So, like, this is a mashing challenge as much as timing. Oh, perfect oh, angle! Yeah, I, I mean, this is the triple crown of you going home. Oh, yes, yes, boys, here it goes! Oh, man, you're for Ireland! No. Oh, it was... You got a less really less score that time. What do you mean, go home? Still higher than any of yours. <laughs> it was, like, way worse. <laughs> All right, yeah, I'm feeling very perspective now. Oh, I, come I, I, on! I can get 36 I until people. the fucking cows come home and come They're all over the gym. They're never coming home. They're come all over the gym. Oh, I'm so confused. <laughs> I did that perfectly. Have you guys oh, okay. checked? I'm not beating that shit. Have what you checked Google Maps to figure out the best route from your current place to your home is? <laughs> I, that is actually the highest score I've ever seen. What if the perfect angle is a red herring like my oh. dad said? Ryan's using a turbo controller. What about entropy? Yeah, bullshit. He's using cheat codes. How oh, are you man. doing it though? For real? It's the easiest thing in the world. You just you just scratch He's and so sniff. Strong. It's a scratch and then it's a snap. You have a entropy, higher level man. shot putter, don't you? <laughs> you leveled up. 
I gave him the the moon gloves. You yeah, why can't we just play a game that normalizes all of our levels? Right? Like Shell Shock Live. Exactly like Shell Shock yeah. Live. Yeah. But that doesn't normalize all of our levels. Wait, it does now. Get... No. Which is the problem, though. It was two two no. two each time. Try getting the oh, Yeah, here we go. Wow. Fuck this. all y'all. Uh, Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the show today. <laughs> I, I will oh. accept my fifth place or fourth place performance here as long as somebody goes backwards or diagonally. <laughs> it's, I mean, it happens kind of just by default. Oh, I know. What do you do this one again? Oh, you do the... It's right both down. triggers. It's on both off. alternating. Uh, and then if you want to do a fast one, it's a double tap of both triggers. Yeah, that's yeah. the rhythm. I always never know where my guy is. Okay, there he is. Attention. 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 What if I told you always Set. never is just never? Oh, never mind. Alright. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Got a splinter or something? Yeah, no, it's just like, you just hear the sound effects of people just like, ah! <laughs> Come on! There we go. Oh, I love the camera angle change, man. I hate it. One off the lead, it's Team USA in second place. Third place and a good performance from Jamaica so far. Nice and easy. You actually like this one, don't you, Bear? Yeah. You I know why Jamaica's calming. good at water sports? <laughs> why? Because they live on an island. Right. Come on. <laughs> what? <laughs> It is Irie, mom. Get out of here! Who's who's got a white shirt on? That's me. Hey, how's it going? Fall back, oh. Robert. No. I'm coming on you. Do the Olympics work like that? Just fall back and they will. All oh, the momentum, so good. I know, right? I love preserving the momentum in this. I think it's a fun game. God damn it! Stroke! I hate stroke! It. Stroke! Stroke! He's stroking right in. Wow. Real oh, good there. job. All yeah. right. Dude, it mind floods me so hard when the camera changes at the end. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I lose all semblance of rhythm at that point. Uh, Fudge you, Rob. This is even a new PB and you got me. Yeah. By 11 seconds. Fuck me. All right, then. Mm -hmm. Got a bright young lad. That didn't court. feel like 11 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that didn't feel like four minutes and 25 seconds either, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, Kieran, man. Right? County Kark, boy. Kieran time. Please be Kieran. Do they be really Kieran. do that event oh, for like four oh. minutes? Trampling. You Kieran? Yeah, probably. They in like Olympics, in Olympic skulls, that race goes for four minutes? That seems insane. Yeah, that's pretty hardcore. Why? Four minutes of like athletic performance? It doesn't seem that insane. You ever seen a marathon? They run for you like. You ever seen a game of football? Two and a half hours. You ever see a? You ever see a man drink Bailey's from a shoe? <laughs> <laughs> I have actually. Great work with the routine there. Thank you. No problem. Oh, that's uh, oh, I hate what? Okay, yeah, no, that I didn't press that. No. Come on, we really or it, or any of those buttons. Oh god damn it. What the fuck is oh happening? my god, it's not possible. Oh he really Oh yeah. Beautifully. Oh that is precision right there. I like how this one is basically a race. Yeah. 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 That's no. bullshit. Just spam an X that doesn't doesn't do anything, huh? Yeah, I was like I hit a button and it said no. Yeah, it keeps doing that. It's not possible. This one's not possible. I don't know if I did badly or not. Like, if you complete it, you didn't do badly. Yeah, I guess so. They always seem pumped, like to finish the routine. I guess I did good. How in the hell? I got like a perfect score. Yeah, actually, I missed, I missed like six buttons. <laughs> wow. <laughs> this is the most confusing game, man. It really <laughs> is. I really hate trampoline. Probably the worst one. Now it's Skulls is. 
Yeah, skulls is okay. worse. Yeah, definitely. Wow, harsh points from Japan there. What's up with that? <laughs> yeah. You're they like do a bunch that. of skulls haters. Hey, mm -hmm. Rob. Nice score. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, man. Oh, yeah. you know what? I got uh, all of my scores were above nine from the judges, but apparently that's the worst that you got. You one tenth of the week number, though. Yeah, I, you know, you're probably right. <gasps> Let's go. Oh, this is not Kieran, though. This is um, mountain biking. Velodrome. <laughs> hey. What about what about Velodrome? <laughs> Yo, these people should get off the interior of the track. They're about to get <laughs> dusted. Your crocodile yeah, they alligators. <laughs> They're Did all. You guys see the gift. Did Best of, Buy uh, sponsor a field trip or something over here? <laughs> <laughs> You see the gift of the uh, that the old guy who's like on the track where the runners are running, and then somebody clearly goes like, uh, "Oh, look out!" And he accidentally he has a fifty percent chance to choose wrong, and he does, and just oh just no, fucking, he tackles the runners. <laughs> oh no, that's so you good. always go like lift. Yeah. They're grunting. Yeah. I'm coming for you. Oh my god! Gladiator over here. No! Uh... Oh no, there he is! <laughs> Use the slipstream. God damn it. Austin, what the fuck happened, man? I, I, I didn't see you like all race. It's 40 seconds of running into men's asses with a bike. <laughs> <laughs> they shouldn't I got, do those, I got surprised. Uh, I thought I had another spin around the track. Just yeah, a I'm nice, ready. leisurely bike ride. <laughs> I was getting ready for the slipstream. Yeah. Oh, well, I did awful go. Awful. Austin took you five medals to do what I did in three. No idea. <laughs> 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 well, anyway, take some time to our channel. So let's start with uh, Bear Taffy. Hello. Hello. I would like Hello. to point out, I like how other people, like, ask if they can be on the show. I yeah. like the way you do it, where you just show up. Yo, <laughs> but here's the thing. Y'all don't like plan it anywhere I know it exists anymore, so I don't know if I can go on. So I just sort of <laughs> assume that it's okay. And usually it ends up being okay. Right? Yes. That's true. All right. Anyway, hi. Uh, hi. Hi. Hello. I'm Bear. Hello. Hey, Bear. Hey. Hi, Bear. Yeah, hey guys. Uh, I'm on YouTube, Twitch. Nice. You are? Twitter as well. Nice. Been on there sometimes. It's just B A E R Taffy. And. Yeah. Sick. That's it, huh? Yeah. Hey, that's, why that's... don't you go, Robert? Yeah, hi, I'm Rob, also known as Alpac Patrol. You can find me at Alpac Patrol everywhere, Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube, uh, Twitch, uh, Twitch, I'm gonna play, uh, Donald War 3 when that comes Sorry, out. Sorry, uh, <laughs> what, what did you just say? say? I don't know, what did it, what did it sound like? It uh, sounded like you said the, Donald the, Pitling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, Donald Pitling and I are going to have a fun time playing <laughs> Donald War 3, uh, once that comes out soon, so, I'm pretty excited to play that. Die, uh, you want check. <laughs> you summon me? <laughs> <laughs> Are there pictures of Daihu Ajak yet? Because I really hope so. What about uh, Donald Pitling? <laughs> yeah, Donald Pitling and Daihu Ajak, they think, well, that's his keeper, is Donald Pitling. Oh, yeah. I'm looking him up. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so yeah, uh, Dawn of War, when that comes out, and also I stream pretty much every day, and also on YouTube and uh, put up my ukulele series and uh, possibly some more stuff uh, soon. So, yeah. I Dolph, found Dolph, him. Dolph. Donald Pitling. I'm putting him on stream. Nice. How about the. Oh, it's Tin. Uh, hi. Twitch.tv slash last underscore underscore wolf. Did I say that right? You said Ray. Ray? <laughs> I knew there was something off there. I couldn't tell what it was. Yeah, I'm uh, Ray from Twitch. Come follow me at twitch.tv slash brownman. Um, nice stream every single day from 1 to 6 p.m. Central Time. So you come watch. Okay. How about you, Nick? <laughs> First of all, that's Donald Pitling. Uh, if anyone's interested, I put a nice photo of him from like his yearbook. Uh, from I guess it's like his company. I guess because he's like he looks like he's fifty. Anyway, uh, you can check me out youtubecom slash smile or twittercom slash smile. I'm going to be streaming Outlast two in a little bit. Uh, I'm just going to take a short break between 
uh, and then I'll be back maybe half an hour, uh, and we'll be back for more. So thanks for watching, everybody. Sick, sick, sick. I'm going to hang up on you guys. Thanks for being on the show. Yeah, all thanks right, for having me on. All right, all right. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, 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 I've hung out on them. Let's do uh, some shout outs. Thanks to everybody for your support today. It was a good NLSS. We had a fun time. We won a million dollars, which is pretty cool. Thank you to Og, Smashface, Showbob, Echo One Scout, Ketsuo Taberu, Hare Krishna, Ketsuo Taberu, and Team You Win for the subscriptions. Tissues, or not subscriptions, sorry, the bits. Tissues if you're in your room. Toilet paper if you're in the bathroom. Paper towels if you're in the kitchen. I don't know about that one. Uh, Catch me outside, I don't know about that one. The Haunting Presence, these are subscriptions now. The Haunting Presence, Super Senpai 69, Super Bentley, Peter Dutorg, Sprocket 5, The Real Vagerot, Idealization, Hugs Not Drugs, Angelo 4316, Oselth, Killer Brochen, King 2 Killer, The Disappointing Gatsby, Beyond Elemental, Weird Webster, Sir Whaleman, Jazzy T, Deep Sea Fanglyfish, Stuffed Croc, Valhauska, Candidate Plays, Dilatorily, Texas Fight 123, Gladera, Papa Onion, Cap'n Charlie, Kowalski, Yogi Isbar, So I Can Unsub, Shanezor12, Elevorsaurus, Fizzit86, Solid Gold14, General Guide, Dracula Fetus, Dirty Dan42, Insert Name Here, Girdlepoo, Sir Man McBeardly, Amorix, Johnny Lasagna, Dark Wolf6660, Dotor Cavallo, Jack O'Carr, Blaze71, sorry, Blaze7010, Tyrant Carthris, The Flamango, Double Taco, ID319, Rinbold, The Snackerfice, Termins, Bolt693, Jonafine, Trevnute, Flatlander4657, Mando Ramser, Randomly Illegal, Seska, Mamarian, Devil's Toaster, Skassan, Samuel Jam, Sad Beep, Dashin Assassin, Toasted14, Centaur Pie, Tiz- Tivzel3, Wrath SF, Captain Juggy, Stock27, Derpakin, Kermit Crab, Darth Scar, Trojan Prince Hector, Papa John 6969, Jerkin and Lurkin, Uninnocent Bunny, Stoneless B57, The Azatom, Bananas Go Moo, Frown Free Zone, Jay Abruane, D Chan 121, Christmas 95, Cal L. Brown, Matt for short, Eskimo Bill, Mr. Ashley D, Streetlight Manifesto, Swagged by Mom, Neutral Weird, Ty Steel, Reservoir Dog, Dewey Finn, 1000 Tiny Llamas, Give That. Pussy some air, boss. Mustard Puddin', Poppin' Loch Ness Monster, Total Bread Roll, and Scalpum Knowles 86. Thank you for the subscriptions, the resubs. Thanks to those of you who made an effort to watch. Those of you who made an effort to watch without ad block as well. Kate's going to be live after this at twitch.tv slash lovelymomo. She's going to be playing a little Heroes of the Storm. You should go to her chat and say, I must protect the wild. And also show her your support at twitch.tv slash lovelymomo. Also, thank you, Flutters and Stewman80. For now, thanks for watching. See you on Wednesday. Goodbye.